Hey, 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 what's going on, everybody? Welcome to Gold Rush the Game Friday night stream here coming at you. Good to see everybody. David, great news, man. Glad the grandparents are out. Since, uh, that's awesome, man. It's great to hear, as always. Love hearing updates from you guys as well. Gavin, what's up? Jay Paul. Uh, got some more guys in here to say hey. Obeyed Boss, what's up? Fuse MC Birch. What is up, man? How are you? Jeff B., how are you? Mr. Bullet, good to see you guys as well. Dakota, what's up? Walter, howdy, how are you there? Uh, a couple of my favorite mods there, man. Hope you guys are doing well. Nissan's Blade, the Master Gamer, how are you? Brian, good to see you as well. Who else we got in here? There's Gavin, what's up, man? How are you? Dakota Forest Bud, hello, everyone. How are you, man? Just got the headers put on you. Camaro, sweet dude. What's up, Matt Whitfield? We're actually starting halfway on time today. It's 1030. Got a couple minutes left here before we uh, get going here. What's up there, Mitch Tag 12? Good to see you, man. That's awesome, man. <laughs> What's up there, Mr. Gary? How are you? I hope you are doing well. Uh, we should be able to start here uh, doing some uh, Euro Truck here. Well, there's just a, been a bunch of stuff on the channel. We'll set some stuff up here as we get going uh, and get into our episode here. Smash Silly, What's up? How are you? I hope you're doing well. <laughs> the Canada weather's not good like bad weather, yeah. Uh, <laughs> oh, I, uh, yeah, that stinks there, babe. That stinks, man. I, I've not really had any problems with this. It's been pretty, pretty, I don't want to say stationary, but it's been pretty solid for me. So, what's up there, Tyler? How are you, man? Uh, I am doing great there, Matt. Thanks for asking, buddy. What's up, Brett? Uh, it's okay, man. The catch on the download, that's all right, dude. So the time for farmers now to see mud runner spin tires and now farm sim just finished a run for Aberdeen away. I hear you, Walter. Akuna Metata. <laughs> What's up, Dennis? How are you, man? Is that Talon28? How are you? Hope you're doing well. Good to see everybody here. Good uh DLC's not out yet. We got about another week and a half, maybe close to two. Well, close to two weeks. Yeah, so. <laughs> What's up there, Michael Lee? Good to see you, man. Great to see you, actually, by the way. Simon, what's up? Please say hey to my son, Jackson. He finds it hilarious. What's up, Jackson? How are you? A big hello here from Full Tilt Gaming. Hope you're doing well. Hope you are doing well. Yeah, I hear that, Obeyed. Yeah, I hear you, man. Oh, school the kid up one legend. Well, thanks for the thought, Brian. I appreciate the thought, man. Logger once is six below here, Dad. Give it. <laughs> did I miss uh did I miss a oh okay no 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 it comes out the 18th yep ace in the whole front i hope it is i hope it is i hope it is i tell you what we got 15 seconds here so I'll tell you what let me rerun that uh i totally just completely bombed my intro in the beginning and, and totally went back across so uh, I tell you what, let's roll it. Let's hit it here. 10 seconds coming right back at you. Another episode here uh, of Gold Rush Full Tilt Gaming FTG coming at you here in 15 seconds. We'll be back. All right, there we go. We're just going to go ahead and roll it straight on over here to our main game. That way we get all our screens and everything off. So welcome, everybody. I hope you all are doing well. Welcome to a uh, here at Nighthawk Parcel or Nighthawk Valley, whichever you want to call it. Uh, we've been uh, working on the road, so we've got pretty much the road done on the backside. Uh, so now we've got two at least potential claims. So we're going to do a little bit of drilling. Let's figure out exactly where our gold is, how deep our gold is, uh, and then maybe look at one more spot, and then we're going to continue the dig uh, at least where we're at on the on the far side of the claim in the elbow. Uh, let me pull up gold map here, let you guys know what we're doing and where we're at, that kind of stuff. Uh, let's go to our gold map. All right, so right here is where we worked at in our last episode here. Um, so now we've got new roads in. We've got a new road here basically on the outside. So we have 392 uh, all the way up the corner here to 164. So now we've got a smooth... Uh, smooth sailing road from 164 all the way back up here to this top of the claim. We still got 425, 69, and these, at least these two pockets here. So I imagine at some point here, this little uh, area right here, if you guys can see that, uh, this little area here is probably going to be a little bit richer in gold uh, and maybe a streak. And these other ones will more than likely be spots or big pots, you know, that we can do stuff. What's up, Joseph Peter? What's up, man? Hope you guys are doing well. Yeah, Golders, it's been a while. It's, it's getting better, man. It's getting better. They they did they, they they roll something out, and then they have to go back and fix it. 
Um, oh, the mic needs a little more volume. Okay. All right. Let's roll it up just a little bit. All right. So I rolled it up a few notches there. Let me know if that's better. Thank you for that. <clears throat> All right. So uh, so we got a few a few areas here. Uh, a couple of here on the back side. And we got 504, 383, a lot of these right here are all, uh, you know, probably going to be more like big spots that we might have some gold in. So we're going to go and at least drill around a couple of these just to just to see what we've got and see where we might have. Because the one thing I've learned about this game already, and you guys probably um, are probably going to see this at least a little bit uh, as you get back into Gold Rush, um, is when you get down here and look at your drilling, you say it was 3.4 meters in, start getting some gold. This one's actually a good pop right here at 236. It's not too far in. Neither is this one right here, which is why I did it. I thought, well, let's do this one. It'll be simple to get a good bit of gold out of here. Plus, we'll get to use our new road. The same with 236 as well. So 3.4 all the way into 11.2 meters down at 7.5 ounces per cubed meter. So uh, we've got a pretty good amount of gold. Now, the cool thing is, is you can drill after you dig. So if you want to level off, then drill again to make sure that you have not clear cut into the gold or that you're right on top of it that works great um, aside from these these get a little bit better but you can see it's a little bit further down and these right here uh, are not too far because that's pretty much where our solids been 493 is right where our dump truck was sitting last week so we'll see kind of how things are this week i would like to try to clean this up and try to level off the top enough to where we can drive enough where we can dig and have some level footing up there but that's mainly going to be maintenance on that. Uh, but I would like to try to finish and get actually to get back to digging. So only half a meter here. So we're talking like three, four foot. So we will start loading stuff in and, our, and actually start rolling it to uh, the plant today. So that is going to be. So new roads have been built. I want to show that off as well. Uh, after we say what's up, you know, more and more. How to light the drill. I do like it there, Forrest. Northern Vic, what's up, man? Joseph, happy new year. Happy new year to you as well there, my friend. The red line is off the map. Uh, yeah, well, I mean, I, I think, um, yeah, well, I know, I know on this part right here, I mean, I know where this square is, um, but you can only get into so far in there. Janko, is that Janko Hunis? Oh, man, a new sponsor welcoming into the group here. Yeah, there it is. Haven't heard that one in a while. So thank you there, Janko. Appreciate it, man. Uh, always great to welcome in new sponsors here to the channel. So welcome, buddy. Blaze Oak, what's up? Snowy. Oops, sorry, man. Hello. It's all right, man. Don't worry about it. <laughs> hey, what's happening there, FTG? I'll take either or there, Snowy. Doesn't matter, man. <laughs> all right. So uh, we did a little fuel up here earlier. Now, we do have the bulldozer on the flat side here because I want to just catch up some guys here that maybe did not watch our first couple of episodes. Maybe it's catching up here on two. Uh, I'll let you guys in on where we're at. Um, so we got a couple of things here. Uh, now, this is where we started out right here. Um, now, this is, let's go back, I'll show you on the, uh, whoops, let's go back to the gold map here. Um, so, this one right here is 493. So, you can see we, we basically cleared off. Now, here's the, the top top part of the shelf. So, the top part of the shelf is now five meters down to where we start getting into some gold. Uh, so, after that five meters down, then you're talking, that's like 2.7 or something feet a meter, uh, or maybe it's three point something a meter. But anyway. Uh, long story short, around 15 feet down is when you start hitting gold. So now our 493, we cleared off almost enough. We still got a few feet there that we left, but we're just going to go ahead and continue to start digging there once we start getting the rest of it kind of cleared off. It's a lot. I don't really know the best way to do it because um, you can you know, do the truck and then back up to it and then chunk it back up to it and chunk it. But I don't know, that gets a little monotonous and I haven't quite figured out. The road was a good idea, although I really kind of found out I really didn't need any dirt. I just needed to borrow it from the outsides. So, you know, it replenishes dirt in here like um, like crazy. So that is the one, the one, the square right there that we just highlighted. So let's go back down here. Let's show you the new road. Now we got pretty much most of this built in. So a lot of you guys in here. What's up, Brandon? How are you, man? Hope you're doing good. Negative three in Oakland. Good Lord. That's gold. That's cool. That's a knee knocker there. All right. So we got uh, we got our drills in ready. So here is the finished road. So it comes all the way. It's nice, smooth, all the way down across the side and then right back up. I will say it took me a while to get this right. I had to do and say probably three or four times over just because I it just took a long time to get it. Um, I, I started trying to go back up. Then I wasn't right. Then I had to go back down uh from this side and then go all the way back in and it finally left to right on you guys screen and it finally got in and it worked so whoo 
uh, I'm, I'm at least happy for that. So this is one of the areas that we worked on last video. So now we're going to finally get up here. Now this is the one that's not too far in. So uh, Obeyed Boss was, was talking about this right here is off the map. So this little boundary right here really goes in the rocks. So uh, the aside from the boundary should be a little bit further kicked in over. Uh, because obviously you can't drive up in there in the in the um, you can't drive up in the rocks. So now we're back up here. So this is uh, kind of leveled this out just to let us know where it is. So we can always pull the gold map back up because this is where I want to at least try today because this is gonna give us a chance to dig and get some uh, and get some good gold. So we'll uh, hopefully get some good gold. So we'll toggle that square. So here's where she lies. So I want to see if there's anything else around here. If any, even if we poke a drill. Uh, hole here behind it or to the side of it to at least four corners and see where things um, to see where things are uh, that might give us a better you know might give us a better idea so um, yeah so that's kind of what's on the docket for today so if you guys are ready for it a little bit of digging a little bit of excavating uh, I got some comments you guys really like the excavator over kind of quote unquote cheating with the front end loader uh, front end loader is a little bit broke so I'm hoping it does get a little bit of a fix so we'll uh, we'll kind of see they did, Walter. They uh, updated. Uh, oh, well, thanks there, Guadro. <laughs> well, we try, man. We try. It, it, it feels like it gets nerfed every time, so I'm, I'm hoping they don't nerf it anymore. I've definitely had to, uh, you know, revamp how I try to use it and try to, you know, do some terraining. It's definitely not as easy as it was, but I guess they did it because you're actually having to, you know, dig down into the ground, and it was too easy to do it before, so... Um, and I'm going to see if I can get this. I might have to move the dump truck here. I don't know if it's going to hop this hill or not. Not too bad there. I'm surprised it did it. All right, so I'm going to spin this around. Now, we're going to pull the drill up as well uh, and go ahead and get it at least up here in the area. We're going to drill four corners and see if we have any other gold rich spots around this just so we can uh just so we can you know kind of see what's going on so what's up there dennis what's up mr gary hello to all the new people yes and like typical fashion man i have not done anything to welcome the new guys in here so i see somebody already subscribed there so 7913 as you can know we are now what officially 87 87 away from 8,000. so that's pretty exciting um and, and it's uh yeah i, I don't really think i'd be at 8,000 uh this soon so um, it, that's, that's, it's quite a, yeah, I, I don't, I don't even, I don't even know what to, what to say to it. it. It's really nice. So thanks guys for all the support, especially new sponsors, especially like Mr. Janko coming here and uh, says, Hey, I want to sponsor the channel. So thank you for that. Big show of support as well to you super chatters and guys that donate to the channel, uh, especially for other stuff as well, just for, for giveaways and other stuff. You say, Hey, I want this to really go back into the channel itself. Uh, it doesn't go unnoticed and, uh, thank you guys for all your support. So we're literally, literally not too far away so uh, a few more live streams here and we'll be up there to 8k i know it um but so anyway i say all that to say welcome to all the new guys here if we do have new guys you guys are welcome to just feel free to go ahead and throw it up here in chat and say hey uh, you know just uh throw out you don't have to throw out suggestions if you want to you can uh but just plug into the conversation that's all you really need to do and what's up there gamer for life how are you man whoops whoops wrong wrong, wrong buddy so yeah, so uh, also you follow, can follow me there on Full Tilt. Uh, follow me on Twitter at Full Tilt is the uh, is the Twitter handle there. Ah oh, shoot, I did it again. There we go. All right, woo. All right, I always forget this one. There we go. <laughs> so yeah, so uh, follow me there on Twitter at Full Tilt. Uh, Full Tilt Gaming on Facebook if you want to. Uh, although uh, I think Full Tilt uh, Twitter is probably going to be my main choice. I really like Twitter, so hopefully I can keep that going on. It's a good way to quickly, uh, you know, talk with everybody and, and give, uh, you know, gives answer questions and uh, and be able to tweet out, uh, especially updates to channels and update the videos and yada yada yada. So um, that should be really good. So all right, let's check the gold map here. Uh, now we just drilled 139 there, so pretty much nothing. So we're looking at probably 164 is going to be our one our one little gold pocket up here, which is totally fine because we'll be able to connect this road into 236 as well. So we got to come up here and figure out what's around 236. Um, so let's go ahead. Let's hit up uh, 163, which is right beside us here. Let's see what's going on. Movie night. I hear you, man. No problem here, Jay Paul. Tell her we said hey. It's gonna be like what? The plug to plug it into the conversation. You didn't think of that? No. No. I don't know where the I don't know where the plug is to plug in. 
um uh hands black sands um i don't know i just plug in my ps4 controller and it recognizes it um yeah i and it just did it natively uh so if i take the control out then it automatically goes to keyboard and if i plug it back in it automatically recognizes it so uh, i'm not exactly sure i mean the first uh, thing that goes to mind is that it's potentially that it's not recognizing it at all which is why it doesn't it doesn't come up um all right, so nothing really there. Both of these are all very, very, very slim to none. And that's all the way down to the bottom. Uh, so let's look at 189. That'll be the last one. Hey, what's up, Typical? How are you, man? Yeah, yeah. It's it's actually off the ground. Uh, both of them are, actually. It's like they're spinning like there's a, there's there's no um, there's no differential, like a posi track. <laughs> Just... Phew. Like single wheel drive, really? Um, all right, yeah, let's see this. What's up, the Javon Matthews? What's up? How are you, man? Hope you guys are doing good. Welcome to a good Friday night here. I uh, got, I finally got on an on time start tonight. Doesn't happen all the time, but we're a little bit ready and prepared for the stream tonight. So, whew, go me. All right, so let's see what uh, gold map is. So if you're just joining in with us, uh, all the glare. So 189's got some junk in it. It's got some old junk in the trunk down there. What's it looking like? Oh, pretty nice. Two meters down, seven ounces of cubic uh, cubic yard, basically. So it's even a little bit better than, uh, say, 164. Um, well, shoot. What's uh, 213, 214? Oops. No, 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 no. There we go. Hey, what's up, Steve? Please, 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 please. Oh, yeah, what's up, Dave? Well, tell him uh, we're glad everything uh, everything went well, man. Glad everybody's home and everybody's safe. Everybody's healthy. Do, do you uh, play this game on a computer? Yes, Javon, it is. It's only on uh, PC right now. It's only on PC right now. It will be coming out to console here a little bit later on. Whenever they get it optimized and get everything set and ready to go, they'll port it over for a console release. So uh, eventually, uh, as well, hopefully there'll be some DLC. Um, at least it'll be released on PC. So you guys at least will be able to see what's going on if you are on console. Uh, and then uh, and then really everything else that you kind of see released upon, I, I would assume will just automatically be released. So it should release with DLC that uh, will be microtransaction type stuff. Like, you know, PC will have to do the same thing through Steam. Um, you know, it's kind of the way the world works now with gaming. All right, so 213 is absolutely dead. Nothing there. So we're going to concentrate on 189 and 164. Uh, so let's go up to 236. Uh, someone had said 394, uh, 5, 6, 419. I know 420 for me has got a lot here. Uh, so 420 is a, a good, is already a good peaked one there. Although uh, for as far down as it is, it's really not all that great uh, for the ounce concentration. Uh, my ounce concentrations are much better at 383. Uh, 504 is almost my best. Uh, then 236 is one of those 2200 ounce total gold, uh, at least here on this one right here. So a rich spot part. So 60, 80% uh, of that whole entire spot is gold. <laughs> That's a lot. So let's look at uh, let's look at uh, two. Can we toggle that one? Yeah, let's look at 236. Loot boxes, like, yeah, absolutely bad. <laughs> absolutely. Oh, I forgot. Uh, okay, what did we say? 236 was our, I think that was it. I wish there was a quick key to gold map. 236, okay. All right, let's just check a few of these right here. Uh, and then we'll, uh, and then we'll just, I just want to see because the only thing I'm thinking of is if we roll out the bulldozer some tonight. Uh, this might be a good spot to at least start leveling off and finding and getting an idea while the drill's over here. Let's figure out if we can level off some of this and push it off somewhere else that doesn't have any gold. Because uh, at some point there's not going to be a there's not going to be a reason to go through here and, and and dig all of this out, and run it all the way back to the claim. And there just won't be a point. Uh, so we know 236 is there. So let's go ahead right while we're out of here. Let's hit 260 and 261 right quick. Hey, what's up, O'Neill? Yeah, O'Neal Finn, what's up, man? Good to see you. Brandon, what's up? When you game is... <laughs> what's up, Brandon? How are you, man? I said, Vance, dig on. Tilt the world. What's up, man? John Burt, what's up, man? Good to see you guys. Been a while. 
Uh, it's always great to see guys kind of come back in around the channel, so I uh, appreciate it, guys. Hope you all enjoy a little bit of the new Gold Rush here, a little bit of the, the new claim, and uh, at least it does give you a little bit of a new operation. I can't wait till we get some, uh, you know, get some operational stuff, um, you know, some new wash plant stuff, maybe we can run a little bit more dirt than we used to, so... I'm gonna do a little bit of drilling around our spot. We got a nice hot spot here, 236. So I just wanna, I just wanna hit the four corners around 236 here, uh, and then see what we've got. So I'm just gonna drill a few more pop holes here, uh, and then we'll, uh, we'll get to the, uh, we'll get to the fun. Good thing is about on this, I've got a lot of ways, I've got a lot of places here as well that I can go ahead and start off with the, um, with the bulldozer. Got a lot of places we can kind of level to. And the whole reason behind this is once this part here is I've gotten everything I can get out of that now that I know where the gold's at, uh, we can push dirt that way and not worry about it. So it kind of started at the back with a little bit of the plan that way if we want to push this dirt here off the hill and want to push it that way, uh, we've got open space and got some storage there to do so. And we don't run ruin and dirt in on our 300s back there behind us because um, I know I've got dirt in both of those. We've got gold in both, both claims back there. Um, so yeah, we've got some good stuff there. Yeah, conveyor's going to be good, man. It's going to be good. Hey, what's up, LMC Famous Gaming with Caesar? Man, it's good to see you guys. Man, it's been a while. Always great to see you come back, though, man. Uh, if they're going to add a... I think you mean a dredger there, Blazek. I, I don't know. They, they alluded to the fact that it's a possibility because uh, they've already got the conveyor belts. The problem, I think, is probably going to be what would be the point? Um... Of having a dredge in water even if you could steer it it's just literally back and forth it just it just literally just scoops and scoops and puts the tailings out back and forth almost like a fish's tail wags through a claim um, I don't know how much fun it'll be uh, it might be would it might would be fun assembling it but I don't know operationally uh, how much fun it would be I, f I feel like it'd be boring it'd be cool but it'd be boring uh, man okay Wow Wow this is a big in here 3,000 2,000 there, and that one, 2,000, 2,300, 3,300. Oh, my gosh. Okay, well, that, that's that got to be my biggie. Unless 383 is holding. No, 383 has got 3,300 total gold. Rich spot, 62%. Uh, drill depth of 16 meters, so about halfway down from where they're at. So that's incredible. All right, well, let's, let's, uh, let's do 212, 211, 212. Uh, wow. That's a good one. <laughs> Oh, that's all right, David. You don't have to have a YouTube channel, man. Oh, well, cool there, uh, Hands Black Sands. I appreciate it, man. Uh, I'm, I'm glad. Now, I've always said it's a great game. Uh, you know, they've fallen short on getting some things right as they roll them out, but I feel like they're they're at least trying to make that right, and they're fixing everything. There's a lot of companies that won't even do that. They'll, uh, they'll roll something out, they'll kind of just half it, uh, and then they won't fix it. And then people will buy it, they'll get mad, but people will still buy it. Those people will still be mad, and they still collect their check and go home. <laughs> I mean, it's just, you know, sometimes that's the way it is. It's the way the nasty world goes around. All right, so we'll check these two. Uh, we'll see what these go. You know, like how the tire's moving, yeah. Yeah, it's kind of weird. It should have stopped by now. Must be windy today in, in Haynes. <laughs> uh, okay, so 211, 212, completely dead. So the only ones really that we need to kind of look at, and I would imagine if 284 is dead, then maybe 286 and, is that 286? Yeah, 286 and 7 uh, are probably going to be, I don't know. They, they, they might not be as good. But we, we can go check and find out. Farmson does that absolutely, Jango. <laughs> absolutely. Hey guys, check this great stuff out. It doesn't work. Okay. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Are you serious? Two eighty six and seven. All right. Where where is it at? All right, here we go. <laughs> oh, an ETS or ATS? Yeah, I, I would say they're probably a little bit better. They're actually. I, I feel like they are pretty. They, they are a lot better than the other ones. Melon Gum Gaming finally caught your gold rush tree. Well, what's up, man? Melon was uh, one of our more recent subs there towards uh, 7,900. So welcome to the crew there, Melon. 
biggest fans. I love it, man. Any idea when you want to do a convoy? Uh, yeah. I, 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 every time I get into this, I usually and I and I have plans when I, you know, when I think about what we do with the channel here. Um, you know, I have plans about stuff I want to do, plans about the channel. I've got one other thing that I really want to roll out before we do that. Uh, so I kind of just, you know, uh, I kind of just. I'm kind of, I don't want to say I'm just kind of waiting for that, but I've got some other things community-wise that I want to do before that um, so that it's, uh, it, it's much better. So just give me a little while on that, but convoy-wise, it's still coming. It's still going to come. Uh, it's just X-Plane kind of came in. Gold Rush got a big update. D big DLC's rolling out, and I literally don't feel like I have enough time for the games that I have now. So uh, just bear with me, but that <laughs> we are going to do it because uh, I've said we're going to do it. And by gosh, I want to do it because I think it would be fun. Um, Okay, so 285 has none, so I'm thinking 287 is probably going to have a little bit here. Uh, but that's kind of like, well, we can get down there somewhat. Uh, well, we can't do it. Oh, you mean like old-timey with uh, just the pan? and Well, you don't even need water. Uh-oh. We need water somehow. Um, and I'll see if we can't work that in on our next one, David. I'll see if we can't do that. Yeah, Frankenstein DLC will be good. Um, uh, let's see, uh, Kurt says, try really into, oh, you mean, you mean continually do it? Um, yeah, <laughs> amen, Walter, it gets annoying. I think I know what you're saying there, Kurt. Jack Septicky or Septicky or Septicky, what's up? Uh, probably the next one. I've got a kind of a plan going for this one, David, uh, and I'll I'll, I'll kind of stick to this one just for just for time. Uh, I don't want to let it go too long because that that stuff is it takes a while to do that um, and for no no reward. Plus, you don't really get to use the machinery. Um, but yes, I will plan something to do that in our next one. All right, so 287 is pretty good. Um, and it's really close to the surface, so maybe we can just stay right here. This would actually be really good. Uh, 287 is really close to the surface here, 8 meters, 7 meters down. Uh, every single one of these pockets is huge. Uh, I would almost I would almost guarantee you that at least the corners of these are going to be good as well. Uh, it'll be a six, a six spot. Uh, 238, uh, where is that? All right, so pretty much where our road is. So what we'll do is we'll start back there. We'll dig out 164, and then we'll come back to 238, 263, and then everything right here in this little square is going to be really killer. So we can just run all this to the plant. That actually works out really good. Yo, what's up, Deuce? How are you, man? Uh, no, not on Gold Rush yet. Now, eventually you will on uh, Gold Rush 2, <laughs> but not yet on this one, unfortunately not. Hey, thank you there, Jessica Johnson. Appreciate that subscription. Got any other new guys here like it? Once you don't forget to hit that subscribe button, go ahead and drop a like on the video. Uh, you guys always do that for Gold Rush, so that I, I keep doing it. Um, yeah, I, I usually use that as just a little bit of a, uh, a back and forth to make sure, hey, these guys neither like it, they want to see more, or eh, they kind of liked it, but they really didn't really like it. Uh oh, thought we were stuck there. Uh, just because they didn't really like the video. The viewership was okay, but it didn't really have much interaction. So it was like, you never really know what to think on those. So it always makes a big difference if you guys like the video. So I, I appreciate that from you guys that do do that every single time. So Blindsided, what's up, man? <laughs> Ground <beat. laughs> Cheesy but funny there, Brandon. Uh, possibly, Blaze. Uh, I'm going to have to get... Uh, X Plane was actually went really good the other night, uh, especially to not even have like a. Um, let me turn. Let me turn the volume on this down just a hair. Especially not have like a you know a set. It's just gonna get quieter. Hmm. Interesting. Okay, all right. Uh, so yeah, X-Plane went really good the other night. So thank you guys that came out and uh, checked uh, X-Plane out. 
Um, but uh, yeah, between that one and then really trying to keep up Gold Rush and new DLC as well as ATS and ETS, it's just a lot. So Farmer's Dynasty may come in. I'm just going to need a good break in the action that I can really kind of bring it out. But it may be something I might be able to do some episodes on. Uh, I just kind of get stuck in doing games that I can live stream on. That's, that's the only problem. Uh, I just don't have, i got two kids, and they're young, uh, and one of them's uh, just turning seven months old, so there's a, you know, a big responsibility than that on the weeks and getting them in bed. I just don't have the time for editing, you know, because then I, I need to be live streaming. So I have to pick the lesser of the two evils, and right now that's uh, that's sticking with live streaming because I, uh, I enjoy the connection with chat. Um, so that's... That's usually, uh, you know, that's usually where it comes from. I, I just enjoy this. Enjoy the live streaming way more than I do the recorded video content. And it gives you guys a chance to be able to ask me uh, questions and talk to me and connect with me in a way that you can't do on a recorded video by leaving a comment. You know, that, that kind of thing. So I do take some of that stuff. I, I take it pretty serious. So, All right. Hey, what's up, Noble? How are you, man? Uh, yes, I have tried to use joystick. Uh, the only thing about the joysticks is you cannot separate them if you have two of the same, which is what I do. I have two of the exact same joystick. So uh, I was trying to do bulldozer work. I was trying to do excavator work, uh, trying to make all that happen with two joysticks. And they're not, you can't do them independently. You can if they're two different brands or models, but you can't if they're two of the same. So hopefully they fix that. Um, I would love for them to fix that. It would be awesome. All right, so let's toggle this square. Perfect. So there is our gold rich zone. So we're really not going to go outside of this. We're going to pretty much stay right here. So um, should be good, man. <laughs> the dirt stuck. <laughs> hey, what's up, Vance? Yeah, 99 watches, 25 likes. What's up? Drill the like button. There you go, man. I like it. They even put the gold rush. Uh, you can got the gold rush terminology in there. <laughs> like it, man. Wait a minute. Did we actually hit the bucket? Ah, no, we didn't. <laughs> totally overshot that one there, Michael Jordan. Woo! All right, let's try that. Let's try that again. What's up, gamer mom? How are you? I hope you're doing well. Oh, you know what I could do? There we go. Oh, but we can't see it because we're too close. To say, all right, twenty-eight percent. All right. Let's play the music to Bob the Builder. <laughs> That's a good one, Walter. Yeah, one of these days I actually thought about just going over there and trying it. You know, just to just to have something that I could do some different stuff on that just wasn't, you know. I wouldn't really worry about ad buys, you know, but I still wanted to stream and still wanted to, you know, connect out with, with guys on, you know, that kind of thing. And, and not really put the really time and, like, the true effort like you have to in YouTube. Um, but, yeah, just see what happens. I mean, heck, even if I'm streaming that or doing some ATS or ETS, I'm out. Who knows? I don't care. I just don't, uh, and part of it, I just don't know Twitch as well as I know YouTube. That's the only thing. And it takes a while to learn these these you know this stuff in there. What's up, your boy John? How are you, man? Never have to use. I know, Melon. I'm excited about the conveyor, man. It's gonna be nice. All right, should be almost it there. Let's see what's it at. 83. So one more. I guess two more. Trying to stay warm. Negative 13. Woo. Yeah, I think we got down to like 12, which I know 12 people are like, oh, 12. That's kind of a, a nice balmy night -o down here. But, uh, you know, North Carolina, I mean, we're not in the mountains. So uh, when it gets down to that cold, that's pretty cold for us. I mean, a lot of it, too, goes into house construction, the elderly, pets, you know, homeless people that don't have a house. I mean, that kind of thing. Kids standing at the bus stop. We're just not, we're not usually clothed for that kind of weather. So I, I think even the schools had like a... I know it sounds crazy, but even the schools had like two hour delays because it was so cold in the past couple of nights. So, yeah, it's a heat wave. Yeah, I know. <laughs> and uh, I was going to say, we probably going to see the probably going to see bottom here in just a, in just a minute. All right, so we're going to drive on our new, a new uh, road here that was just recently constructed. Oh, it does, and it drives so wonderful. Now, the only thing is we don't have a, so like a true exit because I haven't quite figured out what to do, but we have a nice, smooth 
uh, transition right here and then we can spin it right up uh, and then throw it right into the uh, right into the plant now I guess the one thing is the you know my only thing with this is deciding do you want to use and utilize basically let it process and then turn everything off um, that's the only thing about working away from the claim like this and then have to come back and then turn everything back on uh, unless you could uh, you, I guess you could run up a couple of dump trucks well we could get us uh, purchase us one more all right so we got our water on let's go ahead and flip everything else on wow that's cold guys <laughs> that's cold D rocker conveyor conveyor container and duplex let's make sure this one's already pretty much half full already so negative 21 to wind chill to negative 35 wow and that's too cold for ftg <laughs> that's too cold and by the way i did take the uh i did take the hog pants loose even though I, they adjusted the feel rate on that i i, I took it out because it was just getting on my nerves What's up, Gary? You're back. Live in the city mountains. I hear you. All right, good deal. All right, so everything's on working. So we'll go ahead and dump this in there. Bro, bro, what's up, man? How are you? <laughs> Stop the <make> speed up. <laughs> Thank you there, Gary. this up hey what's up Ron how are you man all right so I'll see what we've got going on here I I may uh, we'll see how fast this process is. if the fast if the process is pretty fast then I think I'm just going to turn it off here because I don't see any point I don't know, what do you guys think? Do you think I ought to just shut it down here? I don't really know. I mean, because it will, it will process it pretty quick. It would be nice, though, if I had a, uh, if I had a, new, I had a, one more dump truck. It would be a bad thing. I could just run two of them and then just transfer between the both, you know? Let's see what that did. Let's see if it adjusted anything. Because we were on the 40s. So now we're in the 60s. And that was with two, basically. So, okay. Well, that, may, that makes... That, that'd be right about on par there. That'd be uh, essentially two dump trucks. So, uh, they're done dumping. So... I think what I can do is I can at least put both of these in. It just saves me having to keep loading up that little small water pump. That's the only thing I wish they would uh, <clears throat> release the bigger water pump so we won't have to go over there and keep gassing that thing every couple of runs. It's Easy Gamer. What's up, man? How are you? Excavators are the best equipment. That's what we're using tonight. What's up, man? How are you? It just looks pro, man. We're going to dig out this wood little perfect square, man. Look like we just cut a block of cheese out of the ground. <laughs> We're like, wow, that was pretty, uh, <clears throat> that was pretty precise. Yeah, that's how we do things here. Family, make you go. All right, there, Unnoble. Have a good man. Thanks for coming in and saying hey. And it'll be there, man, for you to catch it later. Joey the real bachacho. How are you, man? What's up? Sometimes I can just see the names and uh, I even know what the profile pictures look like. So it's good to see you guys come in, especially with the ones with like really snappy names. <laughs> Keeps it fun and interesting. So welcome, guys. Try. Let's do a different view here. Let's see. Let's get around this side. I 
Hey, what's up, Gamer Dad? Oh, well, thank you there, Melon. Appreciate it, man. Well, I, I, I put some hours, but honestly, I didn't really put many hours on just, um, you know, I, I didn't put many hours on the standard stuff of the game. And I say standard, like, you know, just digging a hole and, and running dirt to a plant. Like, I literally hopped in the bulldozer, man, and I just started going. That's all I did. I probably did that for like two or three straight days. That's all I did, man. I found out what that gold sheet was, and we're like, let's get to making some cool looking terrain. <laughs> And you still can do it now. It just takes you a little bit longer to do it. This is okay. It's fine. Anthony, thanks. What's up, man? Uh, have you done a cleanup of one square? Abs you know what? Actually, I have not. And I only said it because I've got like 60% of mats filled in there. If this square, I know the other stuff that's in the uh, mat came from zero, zero, uh, zero ounce dirt there was it was just trash dirt but i didn't know what else to do with it besides just throw it in the plant and just wash it away um so once this one's done let me tell you right, he brings up a good point so after he does that we're gonna have at least a pretty good idea whether or not this one was any good on the gold map we're right here 164 and 189 most of everything that was came that came from that's in the plant now is this right here trace amounts of gold um and pretty much absolutely none is that is that uh, Ty the Boss? Ty the Boss. What's up, man? How are you? Thanks for your subscription. Appreciate it, buddy. Uh, so these are pretty good. They're not the best, but they're better than the other ones. This one's actually a good one. But I say that to say this: uh, 236, 7, 61, 62. These are all killer ones. Uh, 236. Let's see. 61 is over 3,000. This one's almost 3,000. 2,000 there. 3,062 there. Uh, 2000, I mean, just rich spots, rich, rich spot parts. There's a lot. Drill depth was literally nothing. So like 287 will be a perfect one. This whole entire square is, I know at least out of those squares, I'm going to be pretty close. Uh, I would love to test that. I just don't, I just didn't like, I didn't really have a time. I felt like to, uh, to waste because I didn't really have a lot of time to prep, uh, for it as well, which isn't really a big time excuse. It was just more of a more of a question of reality <laughs> let me uh let's see let me do this let me go ahead and we'll highlight this one back uh, yeah there we go make sure we're uh within the bounds star sitting is checking out it's truly amazing oh. uh seven days to die yeah i saw that one uh, i've got a buddy that plays that one I, i've just never that one's just never um it, I don't know. Those have never really been good for me. Mind of Chaos 1. Welcome, man. Welcome to the channel as well. You guys are all being uh, part of there. We're working our way up there to 8K. So it's good to see you guys. Welcome you into the crew here. So welcome. Any other guys as well that's uh, brand new to the channel that's really never seen much or talked much, feel free to throw. Uh, join in on the conversation. Let me know your thoughts on stuff, excitement levels for DLC. Uh, anything you got, throw it up here as long as it's just pertaining to the conversation and uh, is a part of what's, uh, you know, just a part of what we're talking about. You are more than welcome to throw it up here. Uh, just don't spam the chat. Those kind of, you know, you know those kind of normal stuff, you know. Just act like somebody and you'll be treated like somebody. Uh, PC Isaiah. And how are you, man? Are you doing well? <laughs> Not like us boring name people. <laughs> ah, I missed that one. <laughs> I see it down there, there. Yeah, thank, thanks for the egg, thanks for that that Ryan. Appreciate it, man. Foxhole. Uh, I actually got a buddy Andrew that plays Foxhole. At least he did. I don't know if he still does now. He's actually a mod. He's his computer's had some issues, but uh, Mr. Uh, Monsoor, uh, y'all see him coming in every now and again. He usually kind of hangs out in the wings, uh, comes in when he needs to. Uh, but uh, but yeah, hey, hey, I think he's played uh, Foxhole quite a bit. Just Spino Games. What's up, man? How are you? Oh, father and son. Well, gamer mom and gamer dad and all those guys. That's kind of almost a family affair over there. They got everybody's played games. So uh, they kind of got into it off questions base here, trying to start uh, different random games uh, channels and whatnot. So good luck to you, man. Good luck to you. I always like to seeing that, man. I'd, 
Uh, I enjoyed playing games with my dad. Uh, my mom never, of course, never got into it. She's like, this is stupid. And we, we grew up on Mario and Legend of Zelda and just, you know, the absolute classics. And, uh, you know, I just remember those were just really good times spent with my dad, uh, even though it was, uh, you know, Super Mario. And, I mean, I think he had just as much fun, uh, you know, trying to uh, trying to beat uh, Legend of Zelda just like I was. So that's good stuff, man. I wish you all the success. Oh, well, thanks there, Melon. Oh, we've got a, I tell you what, though, we've got a really good crew of people that show up every time Gold Rush comes up, you know? Uh, every time Gold Rush is up, it's like, they're all there. They're like, hey, what's up? Just here to check out the latest Gold Rush, which is awesome. Uh, there for a while, it was like we had a ton of people in and no subscribers. Like, everybody that, that came and watched was a subscriber, which, I mean, almost in itself is even better than having a bunch of just random new people show up. Uh, to know that all the guys that are here, like, want to be here. Uh, there's there's something to be said about that as well. I mean, it's it's not all like, oh, I didn't put on 500 subscribers tonight. It's like, no, but you had 100 people that really, really, really wanted to watch your stuff. So that's even, that sometimes is even more important. So, like I said, you guys that show up every single time, chance uh, open every time the videos are going, uh, that's just as much support as uh, somebody that comes in and donates money. Uh, every bit of it's needed. So, uh, big shout out to all you guys here in chat watching as well here taking in a live stream on a hopefully a uh, a warmer friday night hopefully it's not too uh too ridiculously cold where you live <laughs> 520 and you're tired yeah i guarantee you man so what part of europe are you from there uh spino see 520 that would almost put you six uh, six hours gmt so that would be poland plus <laughs> oh, we hear their gamer mom. That's cool. Sarge, 1985. Thank you, man. Appreciate this subscription. I think it's about time I changed my uh, my alert thing. We need to get us like a we need to work on something. Get a nice a, a nice cool sound effect from uh, something heavy, heavy machinery. Because now I can say profiles of alerts, so we can do something for Gold Rush and be totally separate from uh, x and all the rest of it. I'm from Belgium. Awesome. Very cool, man. <laughs> it's 24. <laughs> Whoops. Well, that's all right there, Bellin. Uh Not a problem, man. Not a problem. A chainsaw noise. Well, I don't really know why the chainsaw would be. Now, it would be good if we did. We're back doing. Uh, if we were back doing. Um, uh, oh, shoot. If we were back doing uh, farm sim, doing some logging series, I could see a chainsaw being used there, man. That that would be cool. We we could probably swing that. All right, let's let's uh, let's get everything back on before we dump this. I always cut your water on first. Just you know, just saying. Yeah, Dave, you don't have to. You don't have to spam, bro. I don't want him to time you out there, man. Just it's all good. I appreciate the uh, the enthusiasm. I'm doing good. What's up there, Jerry? Jerry Lurker. What's up, man? What's up, Snowy? How are you? Core Games. What's up? How are you? I hope you're doing good, man. It's good to see you as well. Oh wow, Janko, uh, is that uh, Australia? Wow, 106. Woo. Nice and balmy. Hey, what's up, Crypt? How are you? Caden C, what's up? Good to see you as well. Fried spam sandwich. Absolutely disgusting. What's up, Nissans? How are you, man? <laughs> yeah, no problem there, pilot. We're in Belgium too. Wow, man. 
A Jack Hoffman's voice? Oh gosh, man, I need to warm up for old Jack. <laughs> I need to warm up for old Jack. Well, you see here, guys, MPG is going to roll the uh, rock truck back up to the... Todd! Todd! Boo, 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 boo! That's, uh, hey, what's up, gamer girl? Hello, what's up? How are you? Big shout out there to the gamer clan. Hope you guys are doing well. On a, oh, hopefully a warmer Friday night. Gamer Girl 2. I only have the same one. <laughs> Sorry, I thought there was a, thought there was multiples. I was like, wait, 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 wait. <laughs> All right, well, let's continue on. Digging away. Oh, you mean, yeah, for the sub. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, we we'd have to we'd have to go we'd have to uh, go way out on that one. What's up, Alan? Yeah, I don't know. They might. I don't. They may would be okay with that. I don't know. Oh, I know. Missed the loader dump. <laughs> All right. Let's see. Where we got to get to the right uh, right camera angle. Let's see. Is this it? Yeah, there we go. Let's <laughs> get Kelly going. <laughs> oh, yeah, but tell her she's gonna have to get on. Her, she's gonna have to get on her own account to get a proper shout out there, gamer mom. We, we don't we don't give free shout outs here on FTG, you know. Everybody's got to do something. Got to put that work in for a shout out. I'm totally kidding. <laughs> Everybody gets shout outs and get to say hey as much as you want to. And welcome there to Adam. I don't think I got you in there, bud. So thank you for your subscription, Adam. I appreciate it, man. For some odd reason, the alerts are a little bit quieter tonight than... Uh, I'm not sure. Maybe, maybe something changed on that. I, I haven't really touched those because, you know, they're the same sound. And, and they seem to be really quiet. Because right? I barely even heard that when he came through. So, so yeah, man. Thank you there. Uh, appreciate that, Adam. Yeah, for the diesel start sound, yeah. I agree there, Vance. <laughs> Small <down. laughs> There it is, Gamer Girl. What's up? Hi, FTG. Hello, how are you? You guys are doing well. There's Gamer Girl the third. Zach Hall, what's up? Megawatt, what's up? Man, it's good to see you guys. Man, it's like what? It's like eleven thirty. It's like the it's like the, the school bell rang out. Everybody's like, hey, we're here. Dog run. Oh, I hope not. He's still laying down, you know. Maybe he won't hear us on the live stream. <laughs> hey, Megawatt, I'm good, man. How are you? Hope you're doing well. Now, cool deal there, Megawatt. I hope we got lots of gold, man. We got some nice spots here. Can't wait to uh, get these things in the gold tent and see how we did. This one will be relatively small. We've got two main ones here. Once we get this sides, uh, we'll go ahead and... Uh, oh, I don't exactly know how I want to do this. We'll have to see, man. John Sweet, what's up, bro? How are you, man? Good to see you. <laughs> you just woke up. <laughs> Lazy bum. <laughs> Lazy bum. I haven't let the dog out. Yeah, I know, man. Well, these days, I'm just going to kick him out the door and play the old uh, Who Let the Dogs Out thing. Nah, I, I, I wouldn't do that. I'll kick him, but I won't kick him out by himself. He's got to be leashed. He's got to be leashed. He just couldn't survive out there on his own. <laughs> Double XP on Call of Duty got it. Oh, yeah, man. <laughs> oh, that's funny, Anthony. <laughs> Double XP on Call of Duty. That's one game I actually really wanted to. I really wanted to do. I, I would just have to do like stuff like that on a Twitch or something. But it, it just all comes back down to time. Maybe as, uh, especially the younger ones, as they get a little bit older, uh, and things become a little bit more, uh, you know, standard bedtimes and all that kind of stuff. Then, then maybe, maybe, maybe I can work some of that stuff in and spend a little bit more time on it. It's just, you know, as a, it's kind of a second sideline to what I normally do in just real life in general. Uh, it's, it's a little, it's a little tough sometimes to do that. 
spend that much time on it, you know? What's up, Air Magic Gamer? How are you, man? Dark Sun. What's up? Dark Sun. Is that not the... That's Ryan. What's up? Should be. Different buck sides. Oh, I know, man. I, I've been saying that since day one. Uh, that's exactly right, man. I, you know, I look at some of those other ones, especially like Rick, uh, that's uh, with Parker and stuff, man. Dude, it got a huge bucket on the back of that excavator. Um, and I'd love to be able to add, maybe in the mechanics part of it, they'll be able to add, like, where you can take the pins and stuff out, set them on the ground, take the pins out, and then add a new bucket to it. Like, I think that'd be really cool. I mean, even charge it like a, not an extra item, but like something you would buy from the store that, I mean, essentially, you know, would be delivered to the, you know, to the claim or whatnot. Um, but if they up the, the slot size, uh, the slot sizes and stuff, I, I don't see why that couldn't work. Um, okay, we're going to need to get the truck a little closer there. <laughs> Wish all a good night. All right, see you there, Mr. Bullet. Have a good one as always there, man. Thanks for coming in and hanging out. Mr. Con, he, he gets he gets up early. Neither stays up late or gets up really super early to come in and say hey. So, uh, man, thank you for your support there, Mr. Bullet. I appreciate it, man. Yeah, man, appreciate it. Yeah, we're 80 subs away, so we already had some guys come in. Uh, been welcomed in the cruise. We got other guys out there, especially that are brand new. Uh, you guys are more than welcome to just plug on in here. It's kind of my, my little catchphrase here is plug on into what's going on uh, and just uh, you know, be a part of what's going on, um, especially if you want shout outs and all that stuff. Just uh, jump into the conversation. We don't bite. Everybody here is absolutely fantastic. So one of the best live chat gaming channels you'll see around uh, for uh, just cleanliness of the channel as well as the uh, just, just everybody that's here, man. It's just a really, it's a really good place to be. Uh, I would say there's very few places on a Friday night I'd rather be. I really didn't feel that great. I've had some stomach. You know, I don't know if it's something I ate last night. It just really has had me for up all day. And I was, I was debating. I was like, I don't know. Scream. And yin, 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 yin. Then finally I was like, no, I need to do it. It'll be good. And then I get in here and I'm like, oh my God, I couldn't believe I ever thought about not doing this. <laughs> Hey, what's up, Colby? Welcome to you, man. Dylan Stone, what's up? How are you? Uh, okay, what's what's uh, what's what's stopping me here? I feel like. Okay, all right. Wait a minute. Let's get there. We go. Let's get on this side. There we go. There we go. All right. Know what I was doing there? How's the claim doing? Chad says it's going well, man. Uh, the drill's been added a lot there. We're not just mindlessly just drilling and, and digging where we think there might be a little something. Now we kind of know where it's at. So I'll give you guys an update, a midstream update here in uh, about a minute and a half or so. We'll be right at our halfway point. So I'll give all you new guys here that's maybe just jumping in, kind of checking things out, wondering what's going on and why we're just digging in this one spot with the gold square around it. Uh, the assumption would be that there's gold there, and the assumption would be correct. So uh, let's, uh, let me go ahead and, and do a, a last few fill this truck up here. We'll dump it. And then I'll give you a little, uh, give you a little on-stream rundown here, what we got going on and what our plans are, at least for today and uh, maybe for the next uh, couple of episodes, to see how we do, see how our gold cleanouts and all that good stuff are. Loader fixed, kind of, John, but not really. They haven't fixed and, and actually done anything to it, uh, besides fixing that uh, the looping sound issue. So that's it. <laughs> Never assume. <laughs> hey, there's Def. Def the Stranger, Mr. Fortnite on Xbox, or PUBG, one of the two. Well, I guess you're playing PUBG. They don't have this. Fortnite's not on Xbox, is it? How are you, Def? Hope you're doing well, man. Oh, whoops. Sorry. Got, got a little carried ahead, of, got a, carried ahead of myself there. Everybody's like, you're full. Yeah, good morning. Uh, it's almost good morning for me. It's still good evening for me. <laughs> yeah, you're you're say you're you're saying what I'm thinking there, Walter. <laughs> Waiting gold save, save, save. Alright, we'll save right on right on whoop, there it is. Look at there, it did it for us. It's like they were watching you, man. <laughs> Uh, 
Uh, hey, what's up, Charles? Charles, Cal is that Caldwell or Caldeal? How are you, man? Good to see you. Yeah, they've added quite a bit. Uh, as you can see, we've got the D-Rocker, which is still the same thing as the Shaker. It just looks different. Different animations, but it still processes the exact same. Um, but uh, new claim here, as you can see, we're on Nighthawk Valley. Uh, new slot system added to the game, you know, just to give you a little minor kind of a, uh, a little rundown. I mean, they haven't really done a huge, uh, a huge ton. Uh, most of it's been fairly small, but they're getting ready to set up uh, things for the uh, main DLC coming out, I believe, January 18th, I think is when it comes out. So, what's up, ABC69? How are you, man? Uh, I just auto-saved just a minute ago, so that's why I'm not, like, pushing it. That's all right. I said I feel like this thing's been done for forever. Ryan, what's up, man? How are you, Ryan Avery? Hope you're doing well, buddy. Uh, good. The first one, uh, Caudle. Caudle. Is that what I said, Caudle? Or Caudill? I think it's Caudle. <laughs> I don't remember what I said first. We'll take our rock truck here for a little bumpy ride. So we'll try to move this right close in here. All right, so here we go. Let's let's do a let's do a little a little midstream catch up here for those guys uh, that that were uh, not here to get the mustard in the first hour. Maybe I'll get the catch up and complete your. Uh, never mind, that was stupid. All right, uh, gold map. Here we go. So right here is where we're at, 164. Uh, we came up here. We did some test drills. Now this is the part we built in roads. So we've got a road that's literally built right on the corner right here. It goes all the way around. We just backed right down it. Uh, and then we've got this really, really, really nice, really nice gold ridge. I mean, huge ridge almost to the surface. I mean, we're talking like a foot and a half off the surface. And, and at least uh, somewhere around four to five feet, we're going to be at 673 a cubic ounce, which is essentially, I think, the cubic, if it's a, almost a cubic meter, is almost a cubic yard. Uh, it's a little bit bigger than a cubic yard because uh, a meter is bigger than a yard. But it's basically, if you were told a yardstick up, it's a yardstick length, width, depth. So it's, you know, like it's a yard everywhere, uh, except it's a meter. So you take that, it's a, a volumetric measurement. So I guess after that, I mean, it's almost to the surface. So that's a lot. So there's a lot of gold per big scoop of dirt. Uh, so I'm not sure how they calculate it. Like the front end loader, I don't know how they do their volumes per fill rates on different stuff. I'm not sure if there's a mathematical equation that they figured out for that. But anyway, regardless, it doesn't really matter. Um, it's good. Um, so we've got a couple in here. As you can see, 28. Uh, 52 there's one it's 33 so this one's even got 12 uh down to 12 meters down seven so absolutely crazy there thank you there iron pick appreciate your subscription there uh as always man welcome to the crew man welcome to the live stream as well uh so yeah all these right here are all good so 238 63 and this one are all right on the edge of our road um so we're, we're not really going to be able to get into those um, at least not until we dig out the 164 and 189. And these are pretty good. They're not the best, uh, but they're still decent amounts of gold, very, very short into the ground. 189 is the exact same way. So it's got, uh, you know, roughly four or five feet down. It's got some pretty good gold concentration. So that's where we're at, and that's what we're doing today to try to run all these back to the claim. Uh, we spent some time here. Probably on our next couple of episodes, we're going we're gonna to drill around these other ones and figure out where they're at, figure out what they've got on them. Uh, I was going to bring the bulldozer over here and bulldoze because most of these are right here on this cap right here. Um, I think 280 something is like right here. So from here all the way back over in this whole long square right here is all gold here. So I'm going to be able to use this road, which is awesome. I did not plan it this way, uh, but the road is going to be able to service both sides and I'm going to be able to dig and dump right into the truck, which is absolutely amazing. I didn't plan it that way. It just happened to work out. So um, yeah, go me. <laughs> wake up scooter no i am not gonna wake up scooter i lie will not to get him back to sleep he's probably like what i heard my name what somebody somebody wants to see me <laughs> uh yeah they did they did fix the gold numbers they are much 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 sharper now i do wish they would fix i wish they would seat us a little bit further down or give us the option of seating us down into the um you know into the into the cab here i feel like i'm always 
Like, I'm, you know, especially when you're trying to load into something that's just as tall as your cab. I feel like you're like kind of halfway there, but you're a little, you're a little bit short. A little bit short. Blast the rock guy. Yeah, that'd be pretty cool, Steve. Yeah, I yeah, I, I think I, I think so there, gamer mom. Oh, you know what, logger? I didn't even check it, dude. I didn't even check it. All right, we'll check it on the next one. You could be completely right, man, and I've just totally been like, la da 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 da. We're just gonna let some more dirt. Yeah, my bad, dude. <laughs> Thanks, thank, yeah, thank you, thank you for the catch up on that, man. I uh, I, I was putting too much mustard on it. Things we're getting a little too spicy up in here. We need to we need to simmer it down. Everybody's like, wait, what? what what's he talking about? <laughs> All right, yeah, I can't even hardly see where I'm digging. I'm digging, but yeah, there we go. Let's see if we do this backwards. Yeah. Yeah, it's, it's, it's kind of always been that way. I, I thought, now, the moderators in the, uh, oh, I can't do that. Moderator said they didn't touch the. Um, they said they didn't touch the, uh, the the bulldozer, but I know they did. Had to. Standard fashion. Still never cleaned the window. Absolutely not, John. <laughs> Yeah, you got two ways together. Absolutely. I uh, certainly can do that there, Ryan. I gotta say, man, I, I do enjoy the, the, the excavator. I don't really know there wouldn't really be another way to, uh, you know, to get it. I, I I mean, I do like the front end loader. And I mean, there's at some point I kind of wish like you had the ability like we, we kind of used to in, in some of the old ones. Uh, it really wasn't... I guess just for a change of pace, it was always kind of nice on some of those shelves. Like, we used to do it at Rivertown all the time. We'd come in there, we'd put something in, we'd get, uh, um, all right, let's, I'll have to, there it goes, all right. So sometimes at Rivertown, you know, we'd get those uh, big old nice shelves and stuff done, be all proud about them, and then we'd dig off the top dump and then get the front end loader and just swing in there and just scoop them right up. I, I kind of miss doing that. I, I Hopefully at some point. Maybe on that first one might be a good one to do that. I don't really know. I mean, it seems like everything is more pinpointed now, so it's like it's all about the dig. Um, so, I mean, you know, the only thing with that is, is I, I don't know. The only thing with it is just, I guess it's just another, it's another facet to the approach of it. I mean, a lot of people don't need to light the front end loader, and I kind of wish you could do a little bit better operations with loading with the, with the front loader. That would be my only suggestion. Um, would be to would be to add in something to where it's uh, not lucrative um, but there's a way to store or there's a way to put pay there that you could easily get it up into the conveyor belt with front end loader and kind of use it the way you know a front end loader was really always kind of designed to run because uh, pretty much they do all their rock trucking and use and stack everything in with excavators then they use the front end loader to kind of use it to load unless you know they're working in some kind of a, a funkier area where they need that height and need need what the excavator can give to them. But most of the time, their buckets are big enough where they almost get the same amount uh, of dirt in there. So uh, make sure the water. Oop! Sorry, right, logger. Let's see if he's right. He is. Everything was full. Yeah. <laughs> uh. Wait a minute. What? Do do what? I can't. Get a little cheesy on the burgers. <laughs> hey now, hey now, hey now. Yes, you can use the claw face. I, I will hit it up on the next one. I'm not sure what you mean. Read your last text. Yeah, do it. I'm not sure what I'm doing. <laughs> Flannel pants. Wow. It gets hot up in there. What's up, Brandon? How are you, man? 
Steve, yeah, oh man, yeah, dude. Yeah, super dozer, that would be awesome, man. Uh, there's there's lots of things. I, I I would really like to see like something bigger come in. And maybe maybe there will. Maybe there will. I think part of that'll be the success of what we have so far. So um yeah, you you may be right there, Logger. You may be totally right. So we uh don't have any of these, so let's um all right, well I've got these. Let's just uh there's not gonna be any dirt in there. Uh, I know there's not. Let's do this. Um I don't Y'all probably ain't gonna like this, but I don't want to clean out everything on this yet. Uh, I am gonna wash the mats out, and I'm gonna put them back in, and we're gonna keep going. Cause I'm kind of thinking these three buckets right here were the hog pan, and then our first load off. So right now, go ahead and switch over these other two. Uh, we'll put two more fresh buckets in here, and then all of this new dirt's gonna be all the new gold, uh, and we'll be able to compare the both. But I'm not gonna do a clean out uh, on this just because we've only just literally just kind of started. So I'm gonna. It's going to wash out, um, and then we'll uh, we'll go from there. Oh, yeah, yeah, the, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I didn't know if there was, a, if there was like a, uh, if there was like, you know, like a, a together gift uh, the, for the comment about the, uh, about the flannel. I didn't know if I was supposed to do something because somebody got some flannel, flannel undies. I, I didn't quite understand that one. I was a little bit lost on that. <laughs> I was like, wait a minute, wait a minute. We got to keep this family friendly. I think YouTube's already demonetized it <laughs> for whatever reason. I have no idea. All right. You guys do your thing. We'll just do ours down here. Don't worry about us. Uh, all right. So, uh, let's see. All right. I hate doing this, but I don't have a better way to do it right now. You can take the hose pipe and fill in, but uh, for right now, you cannot. I wish they would add the ability to fill the buckets up with the hose pipe. That would make a lot of sense. Um, but this is going to save me from having to run over there and go grab the uh, go grab the green truck and load them in over there. That was for me. Okay. Oh. Oh. Oh, okay. All right. I'm with you now, Ryan. Sorry, man. I was totally a whoo. No, no, it was, no, it was, uh, no. I don't know why uh, every single one of these were demonetized. Every one of my Gold Rush videos are demonetized for about the first thousand. And then they uh, miraculously just okay it. I don't even request a review, and uh, somewhere over a thousand views, it gets taken away. I have no idea why. Every single one. So every single one of these videos to get a thousand views on it, I don't get anything for it. Nope, anything for a thousand views, it's like, nope, nope. Oh, but what's that? Logan Paul can uh, go video somebody that committed suicide in Japan. Hey, look all that great entertainment. I'm not salty. Everybody's like, whoa, what? <laughs> whoa, we have GG just got deep there. <laughs> all right. I hate this. Is the only part I hate. You know what? I uh, wonder if I can do this. Let's try this. Actually, no. Let's just go in and watch these two. And then we'll put we'll put three in a bucket. How about that? Cause I bet I can take that bucket up there and put it on top of the duplex jig. <laughs> yeah, it's it's pretty. Yeah, it's 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 nuts, man. I I don't understand. I mean, it just kind of goes to show you how much uh, uh, the money the world goes around when there's money involved. Oh, look at there, sweet. And turn right around and then throw it right back in there. Uh, there you go. I should have been doing that all along. I don't know why was it. You can reach up at yeah, can you at the end of the jig? Okay, I didn't know if you could or not. I know some of the other claims you can't. You got to be right at the right spot and you can kind of get it from underside, uh, from the underside of it. So, all right, that's cool. All right, we'll throw these two in here and then we'll just move these off to the side. We'll have a couple of clean, clean mats and then we can get back to running some dirt. All right, so this is all, well, there's a little bit from that, but I don't think we probably ran a lot of that, probably never even made it through, unfortunately, because we were, you know, <laughs> we were, uh, yeah, we were full running uh, loads of dirt. So thanks there to Logger for catching us on that one. Uh, I totally would have kept on roll rocking and rolling with it, man.
Okay. Yeah, the screen can tell you. Yeah, I, I will have to remember that. I guess I've just I I've just always done it that way. I guess just just out of habit. I guess. Yep, Walter. I think you're you're right. Well, they they put uh, yeah. Well, I, that, we could start up a whole nother whole nother FTG conversation for this one. What might have for the next live stream? <laughs> Hey, what's up, K. Gary? How are you, man? <laughs> Quite as a church. What's up, Deuce? <laughs> oh, yeah. Well, it, it got to that serious moment, you know, that reckoning moment where it's like, yeah, let's not talk about demonetized videos. It's a little salty, salt in the wound there for a FPG. <laughs> but it's all right. Let's get, let's get back on the, let's get back on the gold. Deuce is absolutely right, man. I am doing great there, Kate Gear. Thanks for asking, man. Is that uh, Kaylin Rocha or Roca? Roca. Kaylin Roca or Rocha? Probably not Rocha, but yeah. <laughs> Thanks, Ryan. Oh, man. She's at work now. That's weird and funny all in the same. What's up, Mr. Scott? Uh, fuel up the pump. You're absolutely right. Uh, I just didn't want to have to switch over, so we also got to go back over and uh, we got to make it a little bit of daylight around here. I I don't think. Let me see. All right, I need to find out too. I know I've got some. Uh, I know I've got some uh, cans around here somewhere. I'm not sure where they're at though. Yeah, it, you know, it wasn't K. Gary, but, um, you know, the, the way I looked at it is I, I may have would have spent that much uh, investment into other things, um, computers and setups and some other different things that I may have would have put that, but I decided to kind of split in the middle and, and uh, you know, get enough to where I could get both. Um, so i kind of been thinking about that ever since I was an X-Plane 9, man, so... I, that was just something regardless I knew that was something on my to do or to buy list um, and uh, and yeah so well, once it came up I had a really 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 great sale on it and I just talked to the wife I was like you know I've wanted this and she's like yeah I guilt a bit her to let me have it <laughs> I was like come on alright Good morning. I'm out of focus. Well, hopefully I'm um, not. That's probably uh, just a refresh there on the, uh, probably on your end. Is the big fuel tank needed too? Is it that low? We need to go back up. Uh, we need to go back also and then fill up our, uh, and get to the trailer there and make it daytime. I don't like working at night. Oh, well, thanks, man. I appreciate it. I had a blast in the X-Plane. So, by the way, for those, hey, what's up, Willem? How are you, man? Good to see you, man. Big fan. All right, well, that's awesome. Uh, okay, yeah, so we're at 74 on that, so we're, we're, we're good on that. All right, let's... Uh, yeah, we just did the power slide there in the fuel truck. <laughs> All right, process old 98, I guess, meters. I guess that's what it is. Uh, does it does it actually lose some if you're going to sleep? I can't remember. I think it's going to. I don't think it does yet. Is it still at 74? Oh, it does. Ah. Well, see. Well, there you learned something new. It used to not. So. Um, Vance, I'm not exactly sure how to answer that. All I know is that they don't like something about something that I'm doing. And it's throwing a flag to their uh, whatever looks through the video and their algorithm that looks through the video and looks through the thumbnails, looks through the descriptions. Um, you know, I used to put like the United Cut or FTG Cut or any of that kind of stuff. And I think because I had the word cut, it would demonetize. But then that really didn't seem to be the answer. So I don't know what it is. I have no idea, man. 
All I know is that's just the uh, it's the nature of the game. And then after I get over a thousand views, see a thousand views is when you can actually manually request them look at your video. So on mine, I kept making a manually request to look at it because I was like, there's nothing in here. And then they would okay it. So now it automatically okay's at a thousand views. Go figure. It knocks two birds out with one song. They don't have to deal with me, but then they still get to demonetize it for a thousand views. So yeah, that's just it's the way the world works. I mean, what are you gonna do? First off, we're going to park our truck much closer so we don't have to uh, drive down there. So, y'all get me all sidetracked tonight. I'm going to be over here crying in my shirt sleeve in a minute. <laughs> What's up, Eric? Uh, done the contest. Well, no, no. Uh, we're not going to. I haven't done it on every single Friday. Uh, I am actually kind of saving up to do one big one when the DLC rolls out. We've had some. Uh, we've had some um, sponsors have come in and actually donated some money to go towards that big sponsorship. I've also got another little small surprise in from another one of our big supporters of the channel. Uh, and it is, uh, it's really cool. Um, I think it is. Uh, so you also will be able to, uh, alongside that, I'll just, I'll throw a sneak peek out. They've asked to not be really revealed as to who did it, which I'll honor that. Uh, but they, uh, they gave me and the fam some and asked some dominoes and then gave a, a nice, uh, electronic email gift card, uh, that I can give away, uh, as the channel for, uh, Partially, I guess, something that DLC nights. You might get DLC and pizza. I was like, yeah. I was like, this is cool. So, uh, so yeah, I was thought that, that's, that's, this, that's good. That's original. So, uh, But I've got, I think right now we've got about 10 or, or maybe it's up to 15 now. I have to go back and look. But around 15 DLC right now have been bought and paid for. Um, or, or at least can be bought and paid for. I won't be able to buy them all. I've tried, uh, I'm going to try hitting up Code Horizon and see if those guys can help give me some bulk. Uh, keys to be able to give away for this rather than just let me pre-purchase them from them if they'll do that um, and that way maybe we can make it happen on there but I, I'll, I'll kind of wait to hear back from them but as of right now that's kind of looks looks like what we got going on so I mean it's gonna be a big DLC night so if you guys are interested in uh, maybe coming and trying to see if you can't win a uh, you know a five uh, five buck DLC for free uh, it's gonna be pretty random I mean we're gonna have a gold clean out but I mean I can I can take uh, you know ten spots of people that are you know say the 15 closest to or you know we could just save up and do a huge big clean out that night and just have tons of buckets to run. I, I don't know. I mean I'm I'm kind of still up for ideas. Uh, maybe you'll get one if you're a new follower on Twitter. Um, you know or get at least be in a chance to do one. Uh, leave a random comment on a YouTube video. I mean we've got a couple different ways to do. I'll try to put out a video. Uh, here this next coming week, kind of let you guys know what I finally settle on. Uh, but I thought it'd be cool. So I mean, you got big DLCs coming up, and we got some big stuff here with the channel planned out. And, uh, and I don't make enough money to do giveaways every single night, so um, I figured it'd be best to like save and put all of our buckets into one big huge basket and just make it rain on DLC night. So I think it'll be good, man. Home <laughs> dope. Keep it BG with the fans, guys. Come on, man. Flannel is good to cry in. Well, I have a hoodie on, so. Oh, wait a minute. Y'all not talking about me. It says that it's a learning. Yeah, I like that, Def. <laughs> I like that. We're learning. We're learning how you guys operate. <laughs> You're right. <laughs> We're learning how to cheat you out of your money that you've worked and worked very hard for. <laughs> oh, cynicism is hit. It is midnight. It is Saturday. Woo! let's do it day 12 season two here we go again our first clean loads here to the uh brand new cleaned out plant here these are from our big gold rich uh crap so we're gonna have to put more uh a gold rich crap yeah so we're gonna have to put more uh i hope to see you i swear i've got some gold cans around here we do i hope so there brian and kevin saka says yeah man give me in on that i want to be on that gold rich now i need to find out what's going on and when fpg streaming so i might be catch that so welcome there to the crew there kevin appreciate it man and thank you for your subscription as always and just looking for a uh, gas can and hmm, that was not on my list of things to buy fortunately yeah it's got fuel in it it's 33 percent so we're we're just a little little on the slew side We'll go fill it up one more time, then we'll bring the fuel truck over. Oh, it looked empty? Yeah. 
It wouldn't surprise, it wouldn't surprise me if it was empty. <laughs> You're just turning rocks down to dry sluice. It'll be all right. I'm sure you'll find some gold. <laughs> hey, what's up, Zeke? How are you, man? Good to see you. Yeah, Steve, that's, well, that's kind of what I thought, you know? I mean, it'll be big, and, and hopefully we can get it out on the social media platforms. You guys, it'll be y'all's responsibility to share it out. Uh, you know, just get a lot of people in here watching and hanging out and have a really good time. Um, of course, I know it's like, no, I'm not sharing with nobody because I want a better chance of winning the clean out. <laughs> I know how you guys think, but y'all have got something better. Y'all know at least what my average clean outs are. So uh, maybe we could just stockpile a just ton of buckets, man, to make it, just make it crazy. Well, we, we try to, you know, we, I, I try to do a little something, even if it's something small, I still enjoy the, uh, you know, I still enjoy just the atmosphere of a good contest. Uh, it doesn't necessarily have to involve, you know, like, oh, we've got a pair of, you know, Astro Gaming $300 headsets. I mean, because I'm not sponsored by anybody. So maybe one of these days, you know, we'll have someone say, hey, we got this for you. Why don't you give it away for your channel or why don't you do this or you know, we're able to purchase some of those things and be able to give them away just because we're making hand over fist and we want to give back. You know, lofty goals, you know, lofty at best. But, uh, but yeah, you know, I mean, any of that kind of stuff. I mean, it's it's just, we try to do a little something. The spirit of the contest is still, uh, there's still something to be said about that, so... Let's go back to, uh, I liked our bucket view here. I like this one. This is good. <laughs> Too well <as> it is. <laughs> I can name it. <laughs> if you get it right tonight, you can name my next kid. That's kind of scary. Well, I name your next kid. I'm going to tell you what the name I picked out already. So just in case you ever do win again, Ryan, you go ahead and just, just in case, you know, you're not there for that night to uh, to claim your prize, your child's next name will be Bocephus. 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 That sounds good, man. Bocephus Avery. Bocephus Avery. That's good, man. I bet your girl like that, too. She's like, oh, Bocephus is such a wonderful name. She's like, what? What's up, Scotty 12? How are you, man? Spell it. Uh, well, Bocephus would be B-O-C-E-P-H-U-S. No. Yeah, Bocephus. Yes, that's it. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Bocephus. <laughs> I am doing well, man. Thanks for asking. Making it snow gold. Yeah, there you go. I don't, I don't think it's B-E-A. Well, I guess you could probably spell it however you wanted to. I mean, I guess you could spell it B-O-S-I-F-U-S -S if you wanted to. <laughs> Go with Joe. <laughs> oh, come on, man. The people could call him Bo for short, or they could just call him Cephas. Hey, what's up, Ace? Quite a pothole. That's right, man. Yeah, we've got a nice uh, couple of gold-rich uh, gold areas right there from our drill spots, and then it's dead everywhere else around it. So we've actually got another one um, that's just right here. We're just driving right beside it. So our road... Our road literally went right through the the really the cream of the crop right there on that back end of the claim so our roads worked out nice that we uh that we bulldozed out yesterday it kind of finished the, the last half of that up in stream uh or at least the last half before the stream that way we could kind of get back to running some dirt today so it's uh it, it's actually been good i mean you know i will tell you this first um you know just i guess for people that may haven't really quite gotten to this yet i've found that that now that you know where the gold's at it's been harder to uh, to get excited about being on the gold. Or not not really nah, that's not really the right thing. I think before you really never knew. So it was more like a design of desire of the hunt. So you were more or less just randomly digging, hoping that you did strike the gold. Now you kinda know where everything's at, so it's more of a uh, it's more of a methodical way um, to see where the gold's at uh, and see where you might be, you know, trying to find that from. So I think it lends itself, I think, to a creative side. It's just now that things have been nerfed and things have been put in a way that makes it tough. Um, but, uh, you know, like the bulldozer doesn't have quite as big a fill rate. And, uh, you know, the front of the loader's got a few things that are still issues with it, I think. 
uh, just from a personal standpoint. But, but yeah, I mean, I, I just think it, it you've got to think a little bit more before you just go randomly digging in a hole in the middle of the claim, and then you have to think, oh, well, crap, I've got gold behind that. Now I'm going to have to either drive it all around or I'm going to have to do something and smooth it up and then, you know, to where I can get back around it. But, um, but yeah, I mean, it's, been, it's worked out really good here because pretty much right here to our right of the truck like if we're here to the right of us from here all the way back is really a huge gold streak uh so we'll be able to pretty much run the bulldozer up right on top of the cliff and then just be able to dig right off of it uh so yeah so it's pretty 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 good i really can't complain pretty good <laughs> name him sue <laughs> Ron, <laughs> Kurt said, do you have him on lease all? <laughs> such a Ron comment. Ron Schleicher, that is. <laughs> it's a 118 year lease. <laughs> That's so wrong. That's so wrong, man. That's so wrong. I bet somebody just got slapped in the next week for that comment. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's good, man. That, that one, that one literally made me laugh. That's good. Absolutely, Gary. I'm just getting caught up here, man. Y'all, y'all, chat's on point tonight, man. Y'all were you? Y'all were holding your own tonight. This is this has been a lot of fun. Friend's name is Avery. Is Avery Run? <laughs> oh, Angel, that's a pretty name. Every time, I, you know, no, it, it's not saying anything about your uh, about the name. But every time I think uh, the name, I think Angelica. I always think of the the sister from the Rugrats. Like you know, like I mean, that's just like an iconic name for the Rugrats. I couldn't tell you any of the other kids' names on the Rugrats except Angelica. Uh, whatever reason, man, she was like that sister that nobody wanted. <laughs> Ah, you get slapped and my answer is you could be replaced. Oh, <laughs> oh snap, son. I'd keep that mouth shut if I were you, Ryan. <laughs> wow. Somebody means business. Lordy. <laughs> Oops, we're going to have to get closer to our uh, to our dumper here. Not quite close enough. There we go. Everyone says that, yeah. What's this? Yeah, especially depending on the the age you are. I mean, some people are going to Rugrats. What? What kind of show are they talking about? Yeah, those those were cartoons in my days. Rugrats, The Simpsons, King of the Hill. Of course, you still see them, but they're not like the originals. Check Messenger. Okay. Do I, do I need to do it right now? Unless it was out of context, please. <laughs> We've done all this work and we have still yet to claim any gold. Almost, uh, all right. I will, Dennis. Zombie Pickles, <laughs> hey, what's up, man? How are you? <laughs> As we run into the rocks, there, I'm sure we just popped all three of our left side tires there. Uh oh, there we go. Uh, fallish, uh, snowy. It should come out in the fall, like October ish, is when it should come out. All right, so catching everybody up a little bit here off our, our random random uh, commenting here in chat, <laughs> fixing the derail. Uh, so yeah, so uh, you guys want to know what's going on? So first off, welcome to all the guys there uh, and ladies possibly as well that might be watching and just kind of new to the channel, just kind of checking everything out. Welcome to you guys. Uh, and if you do like what you see, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. We've got a lot of things coming up, like I said, also with the uh, the DLC coming up. 
Uh, we've got a big, uh, big giveaway planned in for that. We've had some guys jump in uh, and sub tonight here. We're uh, literally 79.22, so we're, what, now 78 away from 8K, so we're making uh, making inroads on getting up there pretty quick. So uh, thank you guys for your support in advance, and also thanks to those guys tonight that have already supported, and to you in chat and those already uh, for here and around the world that have supported uh, the channel here as well. So thanks, guys. Uh, it does mean a lot. I appreciate it. Um, so yeah, I'll be thinking about the uh, next DLC coming up. We've got uh, we'll have a nice big uh, giveaway where we'll have as many DLCs as I can potentially get and buy. We've had some uh, sponsors uh, have donated some money as well uh, to go strictly towards that and to that only. So uh, I've got some money that's already stored up. Those guys already sponsored the channel and they wanted to sponsor uh, something here with the community uh, and throw it even back even further. So special thanks to those guys that do that and they do it consistently. Uh, it's amazing. Um, so yes, yeah, so got all those those kinds of things coming in. Uh, and if you're just kind of wondering where we're at on the claim, what we're doing, what kind of our main plan is, I'll keep you the real quick rundown here. Uh, as that stuff is filling up, we'll let it go ahead and do and we'll uh, get our rock truck emptied out here. So we've got two basic parts of the claim right now that we've at least broken ground on. Oops. All right, what, what, what are we doing here? Oh, Okay, there we go. All right, so we've got two branches right here where the bulldozer's at. Uh, we've got a nice gold claim, and it's pretty much level where the bulldozer's sitting right now is our level spot to where from that point underneath it's got gold rich ground. Everything past that that's up on top of the tier is all just dead dirt. And then now, as you can see, the road that we did, um, which fuel tank's in? Oh, our mobile tank's in. Uh, so our road leads all the way back down to the backside, and there is a lot of really good gold down there. So, uh, for those kind of curious, you know, hey, what we're doing and, and what's going on here, what's what's the end game plan? Uh, really, the end game plan is to get those cleaned out and to get those, um, you know, to really see how much dirt is in there. Compare those to what our drills uh, have been telling us. So we'll pull up our gold map here for those that maybe are just kind of joining in and want to see, uh, you know, kind of what we've got on our drill maps, maybe compared to what you've got. So we'll make us, because uh, we're just about done on this little uh, pothole here. Uh, we're getting really close to the bottom of this this particular claim anyway. And kind of see, we're starting to see the edge of it right there. All right. Uh, pull up our gold map here. So here's where we've got this, where I was telling you before, 493. So we're right there on the top now. 492, 517 is all on that top tier. So you can see all the way up to five meters down, we're pretty much just completely just dead, overburdened dirt. Uh, you can see we've got 420, 560. All these are all about the same. This is uh, pretty good, but it's a little deep, though. It's 12, that's 13. So once you get down here, it's a nice concentration of gold down at the bottom towards the uh, the edge of the rocks there. 383 is one of the best ones here. So our next episode is probably going to focus on drilling around 383 to see exactly what we have on there, see how much gold we have around there. Uh, but right now, we're here at 164 and 189. So we'll have both of those going, uh, both of those going now. So they're pretty much getting to the point where they're getting out. Now, we've got some nice gold concentrates here in 181, I mean 189. And 164 is a little on the shallower side, uh, but it's still good. Good enough to dig out uh, there with the excavator. Now, for 237 and all these right here, they're incredible because all of these are really close to the surface within reason. Uh, so we'll be able to pretty much dig straight from the top and just work our way all the way back uh, and be able to dig all of that out because it's all really close to the surface, as you can see. This would be right here would be our, our level from the uh, surface at zero meters uh, all the way down. Now, if we were to take that in half, and then redrill again, then whatever the redrilled, uh, whatever, whatever the new redrilled number is, is where our, basically our, our quote unquote sea level would be, uh, wherever our main level is, or what our bulldozer or the drill are sitting on. Uh, so that's pretty cool. So everything here is all really close to the surface. So we can pretty much go and think about it really. That's, that's 12, almost 12 square or 12 meters deep, which is I think 2.7 or 2.9 feet a meter. No, is it 3.2? somewhere close to there i know it's three feet in a yard and a meter is a little bit longer um so maybe it's like 3.2 feet per meter uh times 12 so that's 36 feet down is nothing from almost 5.21 ounces a cubic meter all the way to seven and that's for 36 feet so that's literally one of the deepest holes and one of the best so here's the idea, and I'm thinking that what we can do is from 164 to 189, we can level that out and dig down to it and level it out with our 
uh, bulldozer. Once we start d digging down with 236 and 7 right here, we'll actually build our road back on, into it. So we'll be able to pull out of the claim or at least pull out of that hole and circle back around uh, and catch our road back to the claim. So that, I think that's what my mind's going to on this because I'm seeing how deep all of this is. I mean, it's ridiculous. I mean, it's, it's you know, huge golds from two meters down all the way to eight. And that's, that's really, really, really good. The rest of these are much shallower, uh, maybe half that. So uh, just just a little a little fill in there, just kind of where where we're going with this. Uh, it's not just mindless uh, digging, although it, it does seem like that sometimes. Uh, there is a uh, at least I am trying to think about a rhyme to the reason of why we do certain things. So um, so yeah, so there you go. Bear Lundy, what's up, man? Hello. Uh, let me catch up just a little bit here with chat. I saw you guys uh, y'all started. Uh, Indian mustache, what's up, man? How are you? <laughs> Swifty, calm down. <laughs> All right. Jason Anderson, what's up, man? Yeah, I know, man. I know. I really need to buy two, Jason. You're, you're really all right about that. Um, how much longer till... Uh, uh, how much longer to NASCAR? I don't know, man. <laughs> I have no idea. I have no idea. There you go. Three? Uh, okay, 3.3. 3. All right, thank you there, Gary. 3.3. That's close. I was close enough. 3.2. <laughs> oh man, y'all got some good summer nights. That, uh, no. Oh, wow, y'all got some. Y'all, y'all went off the rails there, man. <laughs> Chad just went off the rails. Like, yeah, we're just we're taking this in our own hands. FPGs, keep digging, man. We're just going. We're just going to chill and have our own conversation. Let's do your thing, bro. Oh, yeah, we're going to have to get some fuel in here, too, huh? Wow. All right. Let's just, uh... All right, so this... Oh, we're going up. Whoop. Oh, up. Oh, okay. Whoops. All right. Oh, crap. All right, so we'll fill this sucker up, then we'll uh, spin around. we got to get our excavator scouts to get some fuel. So thanks for catching all that, guys. I'm just, uh... Man, I'm just in my own world over here. Just happy digging and... Oh, what the heck am I doing? Oh my gosh. There we go. All right. <laughs> Gonna have you on that, man. 44, 45 days <laughs> for that score. <laughs> All right. Good night there, Megawatt. Have a good in there, bud. All right. Take it forever. Let's go. Uh, <laughs> look at Dark Soda with the FTG troll moment right there. Oh boy, <laughs> NASCAR is making another left turn. Wait, he turned right. What Swifty move? What? All right, I, I guess I totally missed it, Ryan. May, or if it did, I didn't get it, which is totally possible. Talk to me all stream. Uh, I'll give you my cell. Let me know. I have some ideas, but no computer. Uh, yeah, or you can just hit me up on Twitter too. That's direct message all as well. That's <laughs> yeah, NASCAR. Yeah, NASCAR became you. You're absolutely. You know what, Shade Tree? That's that's actually the probably the the best. Like, uh, yeah, I'm sure there's probably some people that made mad in chat, but yeah, you're you're really right about that. That's probably when me and my parents were actually kept up with it. I was a big Bill Elliott fan when I was younger. And still enjoyed seeing it, um, you know, seeing him race up until he retired. I still enjoyed seeing those. Uh, but once, you know, they came in and the sponsors and you had the Hendrix Motorsports came in and just took over. Uh, yeah, it just it just became very much like, oh, well, who's going to throw a helmet at whose car this week? I was like, nah, come on, guys. We can do better than this. And then the infatuation with Danica Patrick just because she was a chicken could at least make left turns around the track. I never got. Because <clears throat> she wasn't good, that was for sure. She wasn't good in any car either. So I don't know why she belonged up there besides they could sell her. Which is a shame. Alright. There you go. I, NHRA, I can do. I can do some NHRA now. I can do that. I probably, I probably, probably still can't reach this. Let's see. Oh, they let us let us do it. Okay, good deal. 
I like some uh, NHRA as well. We used to go see a few places down here, Rockingham, and we still got some. Uh, they still race the pro mods up in uh, Mooresville, which is here in North Carolina. They still race those guys, uh, and every now and then, this quarter mile track will bring some guys. But we got the NHRA, the, um, the Z-Max Dragway, the four wides down here in Charlotte. So we're going to see that. Uh, I've been down there. I've yet to get down there and actually catch them in a race, but I swear I'm going to do that this spring. So it's going to be good. I, I enjoy that. Alright, so we'll go ahead and we'll leave it there. That's good. I wanna I wanna I wanna kinda get up to a good finishing point for tonight. We got no time to be refueling excavators. <laughs> oh wow, you ugly drag race. I oh, sweet there, Walter. I used to watch a couple of buddies do it, man. I watched them sink their whole entire life savings to lose it all. That's literally that's the truth. I had the prettiest Corvette I think I've ever seen ever hit a drag strip. Completely completely modified like crazy. Someone asked also earlier, by the way, if the claw worked, and the claw absolutely does work. It's the one thing that really does, it's kind of like an extra side item that actually really does, really does work. Alright, so I know pretty much outside of this square there's nothing there, but I'm going to go ahead and make sure I get every bit of that corner, because it's actually, this square here is actually pretty lucrative. So I want to try to get all this off the side here and get a couple of runs in to our plant. Oh, we got y'all, Chuck, man. He, Chuck, y'all got to see him moderating. Uh, he's a big sprint car. Uh, he, lo he loves, man, sprints and the, the dirt cars, the, uh, what do they call those? Are they call those the sprint dirt cars? They call them something else. Like the modified something or another, I can't remember. Yeah, <laughs> he go broke drag racing, amen. That's pretty much what he did. Ha, <laughs> There, yeah, Rod's go to go to the bottom of the glory hole. Hey, John, I think we found it. Let's go ahead and get a prayer in here so we can get rich. That was play on Jack Kaufman's. This is smack helmets and pray for richness. I don't think that's how that works, Jack, but you know you do your thing. <laughs> I think there's quite a few Bible references where they talk about that. <laughs> Uh, all right, Deuce is gone, man. Take off later, everyone. All right, man. Fist bump back at you, man. Hope you uh, have a good night, man. We'll see you here in the next one. I think we'll try to roll some. Actually, we're going to do a Saturday night stream is, uh, is back. Uh, I think we're going to do stra a Saturday tomorrow. Uh, I'm going to try to fly out again tomorrow. Um, I, okay, so let me ask you guys this. I mean, how, how many? Someone give me the rundown. How many we got watching? Because I, I, I want an honest opinion, and I'm not going to. And I'm not just using this as a ploy just to uh, to get you to chat here in channel. I really want to know something. Uh, so someone let me know how much how many people we got in here. Just just curious. 97. Oh wow. Okay. That's quite quite the number. I wouldn't expect the 97. Wow. <laughs> I was expecting a little lower now, but okay. All right. So we got 97 watching. We give or take a couple in and out. So I want to know. We've got uh, obviously we've got some explain just went up on the channel. Um, I, I am really hugely invested in x -Plane. If you click on that video and look at the first, you know, say 15, 20 minutes, watch us take off um, and see the console and all this stuff, I'm hugely invested in it. So it's going to be something that's going to be a part of the channel. I've got a, I've, I'm curious about something. Would you guys be interested in at least me trying to see streaming the ATC side of it? I mean... The ATC is the air traffic control, so uh, and I filled my stuff back out to become a controller in New York 
uh, RTAC, which is basically just the New York control area. John F. Kennedy, uh, you know, LaGuardia, Newark International, a lot of those big airports up there. Uh, so I put in my controller uh, certifications that took my ATC, ATC exams. Would y'all be interested in even like maybe doing 30, 45 minute control, especially like for Friday night, they used to do big things and they do a special events. Would y'all be interested in seeing a stream on one of those where I'm actually controlling traffic, talking to you guys as well as doing uh, doing some of that? I mean, yeah, it's okay if you don't. Uh, I mean, I'm just kind of wanting to see an overall, like, yeah, it would be great. And if, like, five people say it, then I'm going to be like, yeah, well, the other 92 said no. <laughs> so, uh, but it would be, you know, something similar to, you know, the, the, you know I'm, I'll be in the plain side of it. So it would be the total opposite end of that. So um, I just, I'm just kind of curious, just just initial thoughts on that. And if you say, yeah, it might be cool. It might be. And I don't know. I mean, it might not be that exciting. That's the only That's the only problem with it. Uh, but you'd have to wait and do it sp uh, specifically for like nights at their events there uh, so that you know pilots are going to be naturally flying there because it's full you know air traffic control so I'm just kind of curious uh, when you start I uh, usually would never start before 10 30 uh, so I, I think uh, snow cleared out of JFK today uh, so I think I'm going to take out of Washington DC. I've got some of the most amazing Washington scenery that I've, that I've, uh, that's out there, uh, for X plane. So I've got, I've got the entire, uh, New York city skyline as well. Follow me on Twitter. I want to tweet some pics tonight or, or in the morning. Uh, I'm going to tweet some pics out of both of those, uh, surrounding air, uh, airports. You guys can check them out. Um, so yeah, so check those out, but I will be doing some X plane tomorrow. I'm going to try to fly in or out of JFK, depending on. Uh, whichever, you know, whichever tickles my fancy. And I think we'll be in the 767 tomorrow or the 737. I, one of those two. So it'll be a little different plane than we were in, in our last live stream. So uh, just a little programming note. Lord, I thought she done crashed on me. I said, oh boy, I done broke the game. It's weird doing this backwards. Well, North Carolina, uh, it's okay. I could do North to, I could do North to Washington. I usually just try to do hour flights at, at best. I don't, I don't really like really doing longer ones just because it's hard to keep interest for the crews. People just don't want to hear the drone of the engine and, you know, what do you say after that point? It's not a lot going on, so. Oh my gosh, logger, are you serious? <laughs> like, dude, you're going to have to check this, man. I can't watch every stream just to, like, make sure that you're checking your mats, bro. <laughs> Well, if it is, we had fun digging the dirt out. How about that? Whee! <laughs> That's why you pay me. Ah! Oh, j Paul! Wow, with the low blue. Dance, monkey, dance! <laughs> that comedian air traffic controller? Yeah, I don't know. I, I, I doubt I'll be that funny. Not on there, because they're pretty doggone serious about it, so... Oh, he's flown to Cessna. Oh, yeah, Vance. Well, check it out, man. We got two there right on the front channel. So one of them's uh, we're in a Beechcraft 1900, just a just a multi-engine uh, prop. And then the other one, we're in the 757. And uh, got a couple of cameras and got it, you know, got everything. We don't, we're not in the ATC yet because I'm really still trying to test out my console with the, um, the planes and make sure that I know them very well uh, and make sure that, you know, I, I'm as up to uh, the challenge until we add in uh, the air traffic control. But... Uh, but that'll be coming soon enough. I'm, I'm starting to get really comfortable with them. So as soon as I'm comfortable with the plane of how to do everything in it, since they are full motion, not full motion, but they are full uh, simulated systems and everything, everything, the hydraulic pressures and, uh, I mean, literally everything. Cabin pressures are all simulated. I mean, it's just, it's crazy. Full flight management computers are all simulated. So it's really the, it's close to the real deals you're going to get. All right, so we'll get this last load in here. We'll go check our mat since Logger there is going to be our resident keep a FTG on his toes tonight, guy. All right, one more scoop and we'll be good. Oh, Ryan said, I could be. 
<laughs> well, if I let you, the only problem with uh, any anything having like that is uh, that that network is pretty pretty. It's not like multiplayer for FS. You know, everyone's been. I think you're thinking of the Air Force guy that does the funny trolls on the uh, stuff. It's not like that. It's like a it's like a full out serious deal. They would they would straight boot me off the network if they found out I was doing that. That's right, J. Paul. Uh, really nothing. They would just pretend, Rob, pretty much. If you're talking about the controlling aspect of it, uh, accident for me. I mean, it's not really crash physics, so it would just, you know. Hey, you screwed up there, bad. Oh, we're almost. We're only 52. Ah, longer. <laughs> yeah, I do. Hey, what's up, Leah Murphy? Hi, what's up? How are you, Matt Kelly? Hey, man. Oh, see the way you're down. All right, there, Matt. Well, yeah, check it out, man. Uh, it's right there uh, on the main channel. Just scroll down past the past the deal, um, and you'll see it there. I've got two episodes up so far. Uh, one's a multi-engine, uh, just a prop a propeller plane, and the other's a, a full 757. So, uh, whichever one's there to your liking, both of them still kind of generally uh, got the test feel to it. Just just running through a few things, but uh, the 757 one is. Um, it's much better if you've really never seen any of the flight sim stuff and you have no idea what's going on. I try to walk through everything. Just give you a, a just give you a four on one on it before uh, you know we literally throw everybody to the wolves and say, all right, let's take it off. Take off, not take off. All right, they're just Spino Games. Have a good one there, bud. Thanks for coming in and hanging out with us tonight, man. It was a pleasure having you. Come along. All right, so let's just let's just look at what we got going on here. Besides a mess and a big old hole. So we're literally down to the edge right there. So these two squares here, um, I, I guess I well. Uh-oh, 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 oh no, FTG fell in a hole. Okay, we're back. Let me ask us, please. We don't have it on network. <laughs> anyway, it's, it's all got to be with uh, with other networks that other pilots can join. X-Plane doesn't have like a multiplayer network stuff like uh, FSX does. All right, I'm going to try to pull the... We'll get, yeah, we'll we get this last bit. We're only at 50 some percent, so let's get that last bit. I'll pull the dump truck around the backside here. Uh, I'm not sure how much gas it can hold. Um, I don't know if it says that in the store or not. My guess is probably that it doesn't, but I, I could be wrong on that, Snowy. <laughs> 30 days in the hole. <laughs> Well, we've gotten two days in the hole. Two digging days. Yeah, I'd have to see. I mean, I guess you could see that in the store. I'm just, I'm not sure off the top of my head. All right, so we're going to try to get some of this other stuff that's down here. Because this is, there's a lot of really good gold. Now, the one thing that, you know, you got to kind of, got to get past. Oh, besides the fact that, don't even come over here, dog. That come it. You gotta be kidding me, man. Oh my god. Y'all know what that is. Uh, where's the leash? Alright, 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 alright. Dead gummit. Alright, yep, scooter calls. Scooter calls, of course he does. Alright, let's let's go, Bubba. Let's go. Twenty seconds, we'll be back. Let's uh let's roll a little beautiful bean footage here. <laughs> he doesn't have to poop. He just has to pee, which way it'll take him like two seconds. So we'll play a little epic action as are we depart to go outside of the really ridiculously cold here. All right, come on now. They're they're counting on us to be back in 20 seconds. Can you do it? Can you do it? Yeah. Here you want to come say hey? Come here. Come here.
There he is. <laughs> all right. So, all right. We'll be back in 20 seconds. like a it's like a record man he hits that cold air and he's like whoop i gotta get back inside <laughs> it's too cold for this man <laughs> uh, all right all right let's finish up here Oh, come on now. <laughs> 29. <laughs> yeah. Yes, Scooter, they all said, hey, you're, you're loved. Training to the toilet. <laughs> yeah, that'd be so for YouTube. <laughs> yeah. And today on YouTube, uh, Gamer's Dog surpasses the most viewed video after the owner teaches him how to use the toilet instead of interrupt his stream. I had it all wrong. <laughs> all I had to do was put the dog on YouTube. <laughs> Nobody wants to see games. What are you talking about? Oh, I got a St. Bernard, man. I wouldn't mind a big dog. The only thing with big dogs, we, we, we keep ours in the house. Even if I had something bigger, I still would keep it in the house. I just don't really have the uh, the outdoor space for it. Which, you know, it's kind of bad to keep a big dog cooped up in the house. You can get away with a small dog like that, because that's their comfort zone anyway. All right. Zelda, nice. <laughs> Def. <laughs> They're a savage, Def. Oh, he's not allowed in the house. <laughs> well, I can imagine so. <laughs> fame near the famed Chinese theater. Yeah. Maybe they, maybe they can throw a, uh, maybe they can throw a shout out to his owner. Gonna get a shout out at least. Yeah, 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 yeah. Whatever. Some guy named Full Tilt Game. All right, is everything still running? Okay, yeah. Let's <laughs> make sure we're still good on everything. Yeah, I saw him there, Ryan. Oh, wow, we're right there. Okay. Um, i tell you what. So, um, let's do, let's see. Uh, how much are we at here? Let's, let's do some checking here. That's nice. We're at the 60s mark. So, i tell you what it looks like. It's going to be, well, I guess from this... Uh, what was that? Four? We did three loads? Three solid loads? I guess. Let's take this down. Let's see how much more we've got left in this particular uh, in this particular one. Now, I think what we'll do is we'll break ground. Um, break ground with the other one here in our next episode. We 
much gas we got here. Fuel, sorry. Alright, we got enough for one, one more ride down uh, down the road here. I could come in and smooth a lot of that up there. That's what we were just trying to grab off dirt there where we could use for the backing of our road here. Uh, we had to fill in some of this area just to have enough to kind of push us over the edge. Um, let's see here. So no, okay, all right, all right. Well, let's this let's let's fill out this last piece right here, and then this will have is pretty much set up for. This will get all of this pretty much excavated out. So we'll we'll literally what's that one percent? What? Okay, we're gonna switch our camera around. Thank you for that, Steve. Hey, what's up, Brand? How are you, man? Hey, if we got any new people in here as well, let me uh, welcome you guys to the channel and welcome you guys to the live stream as well. We've been going for a few hours here, so uh, kind of catching a little bit of the tail end here on a uh, what, what otherwise is a cool Friday night here. But uh, nonetheless, I hope you've had a uh, good night and welcome to the stream as well. If you did like what you see here, we are uh, getting real close here to our 8,000 goal. We only got a few more subs left, and we'll be there. Uh, so uh, be a part of helping uh, make that goal there if uh, if you want to. Don't just do it because I'm, I'm asking you to or uh, just sub because you like the content. Uh, don't, please don't sub just because I'm asking you to do it. Uh, you won't get anything for it except for a good welcome here to the channel and a nice cool sound effect. But nonetheless, uh, sub if you enjoy what you see here. And don't forget, even if you're not going to sub, if you still like the video and still enjoyed it, but you probably wouldn't come back and watch it, uh, Gold Rush again, maybe it's not your thing, whatever. Uh, don't forget to throw a like on the video, even if you still like the live stream itself and uh, still found it uh, enjoyable. Uh, every little bit of that helps and also helps me just be able to you know, be able to continue to know what people want to see. Uh, and typically, if it doesn't get the views and it doesn't get um, you know people watching it and liking the content, then it's uh, it's hard to put up on the channel continually. So maybe it's something we put up every now and again. So, um, so yeah, keep those likes coming in. Keep those uh, subscriptions and all that good stuff coming in with certain stuff. I take note of all that. Uh, and as well so thanks everybody here that's been in chat today you guys have been awesome uh couldn't ask for a better friday i was a little bit uh a little bit like i said earlier it's a little on the kind of the sick end today i just not uh, haven't been 100 percent so uh i'm glad i decided to uh I'm glad i decided to come in and do stream tonight it was worth it so thank you guys appreciate it <laughs> nice probably a little bit hard for her to play i for her to be hiding uh, she probably does pretty good seeking don't she came her mom <laughs> Hey, what's up, Louisiana Highball? What's up, man? Oh, yeah. I saw that, man. I saw the uh, skin go through the uh, the mod shop there with the uh, workshop. Jeffrey, what's up, man? Sorry, I sorry, I totally uh, totally missed your uh, your chat up there, your hello. So, what's up, man? I hope you're doing well. I always try to say, hey, if anybody, if I was uh, maybe taking a dog out or just preoccupied, if you said, hey, I... Uh, Apologize. Feel free to say hey again. <laughs> Good. Sorry. Yeah. Well, I don't like people to think they ignored when I've when I've uh, you know when I've I've um, you know said hey and said other things to other people and I ignore you. So some people would take it personally. I'm great, man. I'm great. Thanks for asking. Appreciate it. Graveyard. Hey, you've been watching that, Nick, instead of watching my stream, man. I am. You should be ashamed. You should be ashamed, bro. You should be ashamed. You should have been watching. Everybody tell him. Say, Nick, you should have been watching the stream. It was the best ever. You really you missed the whole entire thing. 
black door. Oh, yeah, no, it did. Oh! <laughs> uh, where's our fuel truck? Our fuel truck is down here. All right, so we're, we're, I tell you what, we're going to back this down into the hole here. Hey, what's up, Shine Runner? Yeah, man. Well, uh, as you can see, we have absolutely none, mainly because we haven't cleaned anything out. We'll start saving up and uh, get us a big load of buckets to run in there for our DLC coming up. Uh, big DLC trap again to give away. <laughs> Dude, I'm just picking on you. I'm picking on you, Nick. What stretch? What stretch? Wow. <laughs> All right. So that's, uh, yeah, sure, that's good enough for right now. I'll have to fill it up before we know it. All right, cool. That's going to be it for tonight. Uh, yeah, it's not a real bad idea, right? <laughs> so, perfect, perfect, perfect. So let's give us a little round down synopsis here for, yeah, especially if there's guys that are just tuning in. Hang around for just a few more minutes. I'll tell you what we did do uh, and what we are going to do. Um, let's pull up our gold map here. So one of our things here for this episode was clearing out 164 and 189, which we did surprisingly. I was kind of surprised, uh, but we did we did section those out. Now these really had no gold in them, uh, even all the way down to four uh, four meters down. Um, that's four times 3.3, uh, which is what 12. That's what 12.2, no 13.2. Uh, 13.2 feet uh, and, and literally one ounce. Um, so completely pointless to go outside of 164 and 189. Now, uh, our next episode is going to be the kicker because uh, 236, 37, as you can see over here on the right side, these gold numbers are huge because they're almost all the way to the surface 12 meters down. Uh, same way with 1287. Now, if we want to move back over, let's say take 492, 493, they're still good numbers, but they're only halfway down. So there's a lot of dirt has to be moved um, so that you can get to that gold. Now, 383 is uh, about the same, and 504 is a little bit better, but the concentrations are way more down towards the bottom of bedrock. Uh, even at six meters, there's a, a decent gold. Uh, it, well, that's where the gold starts, but as you can see, it's still only 0.21. So Definitely gets more lucrative as you get uh, down closer to the bottom of the claim board or, or do what they would call the proverbial uh, bedrock. So uh, with that being said, I think this will be our, our this is where our next place is going to start. Uh, now, the cool thing about this is the road that we've done and the, rug, uh, the road that we've created and dug in. I'm going to see if I maybe can uh, fill in 164 and 189. The interesting part will be if you fill it in with dirt from 163 and then redrill, does it still stay the same? Or does it all go away? I'll be interested to see how that works out. But um, I think what I'm going to try to do is push some of this dirt and make a smooth road so that once we start digging down, eventually we're going to dig down into 36 and 7, 61, 62. Eventually we're going to dig down deep enough uh, to the point of where we're going to actually need uh, to, to have us some type of a road to get out of there. Because um, that's, you're talking... Uh, at some of these, that's eight, that's 11, at 12, and even at 12, you're talking about 36 feet down into the ground uh, as well there, and that's uh, 30.3 30, feet down into the ground. So now you're talking deep, 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 deep amounts of, uh, of digging and, and having to get out of there. So at some point, we need to dig some of these and drill some of these to figure out where our other gold-rich claims are uh, and then be able to maneuver from there because we need a way to get that stuff out of the hole. We can't just dig the hole because our excavator arm isn't that, that long. Now, with that being said, if it's big enough hole that we could get the other excavator and the uh, the big, huge DLC Mama Jamma in there, uh, then we could at least have it shoot it straight out of the hole. But I kind of like building the roads. I think that's uh, I think that's that's a lot more fun. So we may move some dirt and may move and maneuver some dirt in there so that we can have us a road to drive out of there uh, and load it up. Even if we wind up using the big uh, the big conveyor belt, uh, still it either way it's it's going to be good. So. Um, yeah, so we'll have to see how that ends up, but that's going to be our plan, at least for the next episode. Uh, so that's going to be it for tonight. So thanks to everybody for coming in. Uh, don't forget to kind of keep track here of the channel 
Uh, and if you haven't, go ahead and subscribe. Make sure that bell's on. And I want to do. Uh, I always give out Twitter notifications, so especially if YouTube's not uh, giving you anything, if it's not you know letting you know when your favorite people are. Look at, to get in your Twitter account. It's free, and I mean it's really simple. Just go follow somebody. You'll get all the tweets. It's not like Facebook where some things you follow you never see anything for. Uh, you just literally go in there and tell it you want to see everything. No importance. I want to see everything from the top down, uh, and literally it'll just be a scrolling feed of everything from day to day of people and of events, especially in the gaming world. It's pretty cool. Uh, there's a lot of really cool stuff um, out there to kind of check out and get information from and get notifications from. So uh, on Twitter, you can do that for me as well. And it's a good way to uh, direct message me as well um, and uh, and just be able to connect with FTG and just everything that's going on here. Uh, it's supposed to get pictures as well, high-res pictures you can use for desktop backgrounds. I mean, anything you want to use those pics for, uh, they're yours to use with as well. Uh, what's up there, Captain Cool 101? Hey, hello. How are you, man? Hope you guys are doing well. So good to see everybody here in in, in tonight. So um, so yes, yeah, so that's gonna be it. So we will uh, be back tomorrow night with X Plane, at least as long as if uh, nothing comes up tomorrow. Uh, but be looking around the channel around uh, 9:45, 10 o'clock. I'm gonna have something on there to where you guys can see whether or not I'm streaming. So like I said, uh, especially tonight, if you have not checked out X Plane, come and check it out tomorrow. It'll be Saturday night, so you ain't got nothing else better to do. Uh, and it's late enough, hopefully, that you can go do some stuff and then come back. Uh, and uh, and hang out with us there. We're going to be in a 767, which is a uh, big plane, and we're going to do some really cool flying into probably JFK or LaGuardia tomorrow night. So it should be like really fun. See the whole entire New York skyline. It's absolutely beautiful, uh, and uh, and, and yeah, and it's really cool. So go check that one out too on X Plane if you have not checked that one out. Uh, that's going to be our next big addition here to the channel uh, as well. So good night, everybody. Phase Def and and Dennis, John, Jeff. John, John Sweet, J. Paul Snowy, Zach, good to see you guys, Gamer, the whole Gamer clan, tell the girls, tell uh, Gamer Boy there, we all said goodbye. Good night there, Gamer Mom. Uh, okay, well, that's no problem, man. Oh, I see, yeah, no problem there. I, yeah, I remember about that story there, so yeah, no problem there, Gamer Mom. Uh, completely understand. Guys, need anything, hit me up. Uh, be glad to you know, do what I could. Uh, but yes, uh, that sounds good to me, so great work. Thank you, man, appreciate that, Vance, as well. Uh, so I think that will be it. Yes, you're absolutely welcome there, Rob. Uh, yeah, absolutely, Rob. I, I would love to see those DL DLC items functioning sooner than later. Uh, I'm kind of looking forward to them. So uh, anyway, that's going to be it for me tonight, guys. I will see you. Remember, uh, life is a journey, so please travel it well. Come travel it well with us tomorrow in x -Plain. Uh We will here see you at least hopefully 1030 as long as nothing comes up. So that's it for me tonight, guys. Like I said, life's a journey. Travel well is the new catchphrase here uh, with FTG United. Uh, aside from that being our official hashtag. And then now, uh, this is so cool. I had to put this out there before everyone leaves. Uh, so if you are a Twitter follower, just type in hashtag FTG and then start the U, and it actually will fill. So it's actually a, a recognizable hashtag now with Twitter. When I was like, wow, so that's cool. So, yeah, so anytime you tweet me, uh, use that use that uh, hashtag, and I'd love to see that trend one of these days. That'd be awesome. So, Greybach, hello and good night. Good to see you there, buddy. Ethan, what's up, man? And goodbye to you. See you there, okay, Gary. We'll catch you tomorrow night as well for another x -Plane. So that's it, guys. Uh, absolutely enjoyed hanging out tonight. This was a really good night. I'm glad I came out and, uh, and hung out. So, uh, now it's time to get some sleep, go to bed, and uh, and get some rest up for tomorrow. i got lots to do tomorrow. So we'll see you guys. Peace out. We'll see you.